exactly. It's it's the same type of quality of life as the. Oh. Hello? Okay. So. Oh, yeah. This is the next quest we need. We have to go speak to the Greybeards. And then we have someone helping us. The Vivid Weather's Rain, personally. The Jarl has appointed me to be your house, Carl. It's an honor to serve you. Carl? Ellie Clark, hello. Uh, I'm a Thane. What does that mean? Yeah, what does that mean? The Jarl has recognized you as a person of great importance in the Hold. A hero. The title of Thane is an honor. A gift for your service. Hmm. Guards will know to look the other way if you tell them who you are. Lydia. What does a house Carl do? As my Thane, I'm sworn to your service. I'll guard you and all you own with my life. Okay. Follow me. I need your help. Lead the way. Why should always have to make eye contact with me? <laughs> Giving Zelda and Link. Yes. First time I ever married anyone in Skyrim, I married Lydia. <gasps> oh. They say there's nothing a Nord woman can't do if she puts her mind to it. Okay. Damn those great names to oblivion. They want to back the storm cloaks. They'll get what's coming to them. That sky is really pretty. Time is it? 7 p.m. Rule the realm. Irrelevant. I want a flashlight. Give me a torch. One thing everyone can agree on: this war is bad for business. It's like, that was like sunset colors. We dark. Hi, McBeanie. You didn't realize how calming Skyrim is for you? Oh yeah, we got a horse also. I forgot to talk about that. Cat's horse. Oh. we first person on the horse? Oh, we can't. Horse period, yeah. Are we still getting followed by our friend? Also, let me see if I can turn the weather, like the, the brightness up a little bit. Oh. Beautiful. The load order? Maybe. Game's not gonna make it. See, this this would be just a nice default night. But this is 5 a.m. Also.
Where am I going for this quest? Is it... Is it that direction? Like, is that it above? It doesn't really... seem to be tracking? Whoa. How about instead of a THY we get a Zillia recap? Sounds good. Ahem, so we were prisoners and then dragons. Then other stuff happened. Yeah, it's and weird then looking. Dragons. Something tells me dragon. The dragons are a part of this game. Something something must be right with that Zai. Um, alright, well. The Greybeards have summoned me to their uh, monastery of High Hrothgar on the slopes of the Throat of the World. They seem to have learned the, mysteri or the, mis the mysterious power that I gained when I killed the dragon outside of Whiterun. So we need to go speak to them, but I... So I guess we go this way? Iversteed instead? Iversteed has the start of the path. So we are we just are we just going to a place? Oh, this is pretty. Hold on, what is this place? Oh, it's the meter. You know what? We went past this when we first got here, I think. And I'm assuming I can't fast travel there because... Oh, because <laughs> we haven't been there, right? It's so dark. Why are the shadows so dark? I don't want it to be this dark. Okay, really rude. I could take a carriage? Somebody help! Is this a trap? Okay. Hi, Disperser. Welcome in. Need something. You were the one screaming for help. Yes. Hello. I'm collecting ingredients to bring to the gourmet. He'll think my taste so refined when I offer them to him. You have heard of the gourmet? No. <laughs> You've not heard not of the, the gourmet? Scoff. Author of Uncommon Taste? He is a wizard with a spatula. Well, not an actual wizard, but his recipes are legendary. You know. I've heard the gourmet is in Skyrim right now. Good talk. The train parallax is broken. Hmm. Not sure what you mean by that. Should have let the wolf eat that guy. This way, maybe? Oh, all the pebbles are spiky? They should be round. Hmm. The horse can die if it takes too much damage. I figured that would probably be the case. Oh no. Am I going the right way still? The pebbles do look a little bit spiky.
Uh, Chia Pet, I think we made a command for, um... The mods. Yeah, S mods, Skyrim mods. <gasps> Julia Bucky 3 sub! Yeah, it made me day to see that you're playing the smiles. This seems like a path. We're just going up the mountain. Rachel, hi. Made my day to see that you're playing this. Well, I'm, I'm happy to hear that. Hello. I just read the description for the enchanted lights and FX mod you're using. It looks like it darkens a lot of things in the game. So maybe I should turn that off? Why do I feel like we untoggled that yesterday and it was still really dark? You never used your horse or a horse in your 100 hours of this game? Like you just chose not to? I feel like that's fair. Like you just ran the whole time. Oh. Wait, what's happening in here? Oh, this is where I need to go. Okay, so I should be coming down here and then taking a right. Okay. All is well. I've played for many, many hours, but also never used a horse. That's funny. I probably wouldn't have gotten a horse unless I walked past it. And I was like, oh, can we get one? <sighs> you stole frost for your horse? Wait, what do you mean? Like, you got a frost horse? Did no one recommend a map mod for Julia? Uh, I think I have a map mod installed. Oh, are these baddies? Who are you? Are they white run soldiers? If you know any true sons and daughters of Skyrim, tell them to head to Windhelm. Ulfric Stormcloak wants to see them. I'm not gonna pickpocket them. What the heck? Oh. Oh, I gotta do a... Why does my mouse... My mouse is like invisible when I play the game and it's like altering all my other monitors. Why is it doing that? Why is it doing that? Yeah, the, is that the vivid weather's rain thing? Why can't I make my mouse only be on this program? Why is it going all over the place? Oops. Where did I go? The mouse cursor thing is a vanilla bug. Ooh, okay. It adds thunder. That's cool. I I guess we'll stay here. Yeah, the controls... Oh, what the hell is that? Uh, the controls to control the horse in uh, Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom is a little bit tricky. Nice, nice, nice. It's a little troll. We're getting trolled. Oops. Are we still getting chased? Oops. I cannot see. Oh! 
Nice. Did the troll take us or follow us? Oops. On your way up the 7,000 steps again, Klimek? Not today. I'm just not ready to make the climb to High Rothgar. The path isn't safe. Aren't the Greybeards expecting some surprise? Honestly, I'm not certain. I've yet to be allowed into the monastery. Perhaps one day. Yeah, so something seems broken here. Hmm. Hey, Scud, how are you? Yeah, that's icky looking. I wonder if I just need to do like... I have no idea. I might do a quick little save. And then, uh, I guess I could have just pressed F5, right? Yeah, I think so. Like it look the lighting definitely looks different. Bears are clever enough to hold a grudge against you this time. When I want your opinion, I'll ask for it. Otherwise, mind your business. Yeah, those rocks are still stubby and definitely very rhubarb looking. <sighs> CJ, hi. No, you're not late. Hello. Okay, anyway, um We're here. Iverstead seed. We spend too much. Oh, too much time modding. What could it mean? The return of the dragonborn, and who among us could possibly hold that on? I guess it's good practice. I just is it, so these must have to. Be, these are supposed to be rocks, I think. For some reason, the pebble textures are. Full. Not what you know. By the gods, it's true, isn't it? A dragon has attacked White Hand. How could mere men bring down such a beast? Mere men. Can I help you? The ground has stubble. Huh? Oh. Oh, you're a traveler. You must have so much to tell about the world outside this little town. Settle down to have you, children. I'd move right through Think our backwards little town. Do it. I, I need you to pitch in a little more around here, dear. I help. I do the chores. What else would you have me do? I know your sights are set beyond this town, but for now, while you're under our roof, I need you to pitch in a little <laughs> more. Yes, mother. Oh my God, drama. Fastrid, better not be here to stir you. up any trouble. What is it now? Wilhelm said he saw you speaking to one of the pilgrims on the seven thousand steps. I told you that I didn't want you to go up there. Is he eating his fingers? I know what you said, but I only wanted to speak to him for a moment. What have they ever done for us? Well, it stops now, and that's final. Have anything interesting to tell me? You have to let Fastrid follow her heart. You can't tell her what to do. She's our only child, Boti. I can't Am imagine I to how to exciting woods? it must be to journey from place to place. You're so lucky. She just wants to see the world, just like I did when I was her age. And if she decides to leave Iverstead, what then? No. No, I can't bear the thought. Don't even think about it. What, because I'm looking at your man? I'm sorry. I don't feel welcome in here. <laughs> Such a strange cat. Yeah. Just squatting in their home. No lollygagging. Lollyga who's I can't get over these rocks now. Those look ridiculous. Hello. Need something? Need something? Apparently not. Stay out of trouble, Kajit. Oh. I thought 
my family was weird. That was a little, uh... That was something. I wish I could make my deliveries more often, but the road's getting dangerous. Passing through on your way to High Hrothgar? About to Hrothgar. make a delivery up there myself. Anything you can tell me about it? I've been to the monastery many times, but I've never even laid eyes on one of the Greybeards. Not that I'd care to. Being masters of the Thum, they could kill you by uttering a single word. Oh, like well, what I can do? Not that they would. They seem peaceful, but I wouldn't want to provoke them. What types of deliveries do you make? Mostly food supplies like dried fish and salted meats. You know, things that keep fresh for a long time. The Greybeards tend not to get out much, if you catch my meaning. Well, it's kind of an understanding between us. I mean, it just wouldn't feel right to charge them for a bit of preserved food. Trouble is, my legs aren't what they used to be, and climbing the 7,000 steps takes its toll. 7,000? Really? Well, that would be kind of you. Here, take this bag of supplies. At the top of the steps, you'll see the offering chest. Just leave the bag inside, and you're done. Offering chest? Anything I should watch out for during the climb? Well, there's the occasional wolf pack or stray, but that's all I've ever had to deal with. Shouldn't be a problem for the likes of you. Other than that, watch your footing. In these wintry conditions, the stairs can be treacherous. Mmm. I've granted you the eyes of a Skyrim modder. My work is done. Wait, are, do you do you know? Is it Inosuke? I hope I'm saying that right. Um, yeah, we have a list of the mods. Let me also I'll share the video that I had followed. Um, as well, and the video kind of will just probably show like the program I had gotten as well. This is that's the one I followed. Shoo. Um, yeah. Kaji can handle the hate because they just steal to make their day worse. Mm. I'm the fish in the background eating off that rock. Oh. Be careful up there. Thanks. Is this supposed to have me, like, is this leading me to the top of the mountain? Oh! <gasps> Oh, that's the steps. Wait. Oh. Okay. So we got to figure out where the steps start. I got to pee, though, first of all. I'll leave you with this uh, nice shot while I go pee. There's a bride at the end of the town? Yeah, I'm going to GPG. I'll be back in just a sec. Oh. My lady. Let me know if you have anything. Yes, my lady. Oh, my lady. <laughs> Anonymous, thank you for gifting us out to Inosuke. I know she's calling us milady. Um, okay. I'm assuming the inn will have someone I can just sell stuff to. I was going to sell stuff before we go up. Of those mods, the one I would imagine having an impact on road textures and impacting parallax and conflicting would be the majestic mountain and or landscapes. Ooh, Okay. I could turn the majestic mountain one look off. Like I think you should continue with your performance. Why bother visiting Ivers? What's the point? I'm not very good, and it's only huh? I think you play beautifully. Sorry. It would be a shame if you stopped. All right, Wilhelm. I suppose it's the least I can do for you. If I were you, I'd keep away from the barrow on the east side of town. Oh, do I not? Oh, what have you got for sale? Take a look. It's in a book. 3D rainbow cat. Oh, I can't sell weapons here. I'd probably have to go to a blacksmith, yeah? What's the tea? I heard tell of a lad in Windhelm. Aventus Aretino. 
They say he's been doing the Black Sacrament, trying to contact the Dark Brotherhood. Damn fool. Mm, okay, we got a little question. If you're headed up to the monastery, watch your step. It's a long way down. I just don't like how they all just stare at me. Oh. Have you spoken to Fastred yet? Yes. No. Brush that hell. If I could sweep her away from here tomorrow. This <laughs> is Skyrim it. NPC behavior. Moment of truth. Are we in Rhubarb City or no? Oh, it's nighttime, so I guess we can't really tell. Well, it's still pretty dark. So, 5 a.m. I, I, I think this was where the rhubarb was. No we more rhubarb. Faithless dogs who this land belongs to. Yeah, the rhubarb was all, all over here. Now, did it basically put this back to vanilla? Like, were those supposed to be extra pebbles? No more rhubarb. I checked nighttime. It was very dark. Well, yeah, we don't really need the stretch textures, I guess. It can just look a little... A little flat. <laughs> yeah, it gives depth, yeah. 3D textures meshes to actually be 3D, just not look. Yeah. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Like two tropical birds dancing. Yeah, things things are looking a, a tad 2D, but that's fine. Have I seen dark th third person? Okay. It's going to be y'all, it's going to be really dark, I feel. Yeah. Yeah, that, I mean, I mean the parallax has nothing to do with the darkness of the game. So obviously that's not going to be different. It's like unbelievably dark. Oh, is this where the steps start? settle down to have children think twice before you do it oh I do so the thing about light and SSE this is always fun what you see versus what the game detects aren't the same mm. those bears are making Miss Timber so angry I hope you can do something about them you can have light appear bright while the game is telling NPCs it's pitch black interesting <laughs> Phoenix, thanks. I hope you sleep well. If you're sleeping. Everything all right? Yeah, it's probably like ambient lighting, but yeah, the outside is just so... So, so, so dark. 
What is this? Is that one of the old ruins? Ooh. No more spiky pebbles, yeah. But now we're just a tad too deep. I know, is there a quick... This has just been a troubleshooting stream so far. We haven't even done anything. Clemex house? The apprentice? It'll depend which version you have. It has three light, enhanced, and hardcore. You might be using enhanced or hardcore. Hmm. <laughs> Meep, I hope you sleep well. Wow. Julia Bucky 3 sub. Yeah, playing modded Skyrim is troubleshooting Why didn't modded Skyrim. Paper yeah. making across the road. It got stuck in the crack. Console. Very nice. Yeah. Huh. Job, I hope you sleep all good night. Okay, well, I think it'll be fine for now. We'll have to troubleshoot a different time because I do want to play it. <laughs> so maybe we can, um... We just go up to the mountains now? So these are all just miscellaneous things from a lot of people, I feel. Oh. Oh, and we can track them individually. Okay. So miscellaneous is just a bunch of just side quests. CJ sounds good. Okay. Um, question, however. do Does anyone know if there is someone that I can sell... Uh, stuff to you. This is cool. 19 damage. This is a big boy. God might get nervous. A woman approaches with her weapon drawn. Sorry? Keep the axe. Very ambitious to attempt 3D terrain on your first playthrough, but like imagine it worked though and it'd be so great. I mean, it should work, you know? Oh, there's not a general store in this town? Fast I wanted to talk about well, I could just fast travel now, right? Remove that, please. Oh, I did. I don't. I W A S D on the map. So maybe I should go to Riverwood, probably, right? I don't know. I just know where they are there. <sighs> Prisma, we haven't. We have been troubleshooting um, some mods and terrain. So now I no longer have 3D terrain because they were looking kind of stubby. Oh, my horse comes with me. That's nice. Feindel thinks he can move Camilla Valerius away from me. Wait, She's so already mine, I keep telling you. You're not serious. <laughs> sure I am. We got some firs and tree branches, paint them white, and then tie them to stump. Instant frostbite spider. Frodnar. White run in most major cities will have multiple places. It Sweet. means so much to us to have the claw back where it Thank lies. you. Some may call this so if this me, dialogue is white treasure. instead of gray, does that mean that he's going to have new things? So sell that. Keep the bow. Maybe keep the arrows. Why do, do I have a lot of... Okay. Oh, yeah. Should I just get rid of this since I'm trying not to wear heavy armor?
Oh yeah, Alex, it was been, the 3D textures weren't loading. They were looking, all the rocks were looking like strawberry rhubarb. Or just rhubarb, sorry, not the strawberry. Yeah. Hmm. Disenchanted? Oh, because I could just learn the enchantment? It weighs 35. Like, this isn't a big boy. Iron's pretty cheap, so it may be worth it to disenchant and learn the enchantment. I could. I could give it to Lydia. That's true. Um... Oh, the dragon stuff is quite heavy, isn't it? So should I just give that all to her? All right then. Yes, my lady. My lady. Here's everything I have. Give it to Lydia the pack mule. Oh my god. So do I just? So now she has it. Okay. That helps a lot. I'll guard you with my life. You and me. Take Watch what look. you're doing. Oh, no, no, no. Let me get rid of these. I don't need these. I, I feel like I could keep these. Speechcraft. Okay. I'm totally covering what I'm looking at, but All right then. <sighs> uh Pango, it, it went here nor there. We got rid of the the funky looking three D stuff. Um but now we kinda got two D textures. But you see I seem alright. Okay, but now we're gonna climb a mountain. You're telling me I napped and missed the first two and a half hours? Sequence, guess what? You missed pretty much nothing. We were kind of troubleshooting for a good, you know, on and off bit. 7,000 steps. Okay. Um, I am really quickly gonna go grab a snack, I think before we just endure this hike. You have over 10,000 hours in it. Ooh. Or until part six comes out in the next two or three years. I, that's what I heard uh, Skyrim 6 is going to be coming out soon. I mean, I'm fine to do 3D terrain on this playthrough. I just want it to like, I, I got to figure out how to load it properly. Oh, because I would like it to be pretty. Um, okay. I'm going to be right back. I'm going to go grab a snack. I know this is a lot of steps. 2026. That's exciting. I know. I might get another little cheese stick in a granola bar. All right. I'll be back in a sec. And then we'll actually do it. Do this stuff. Oh, what's this? Before the birth of men, <clears throat> the dragons ruled all Mundus. Their word was the voice, and they spoke only for true needs. For the voice could blot out the sky and flood the land. Lore tablet. Nice. Mel. They're along the path. Okay. Mm-hmm. 
What is that? Are you going to attack me? What was that? Oh, ew. That takes care of that. Oh, it's a skeever. Ooh. Garnet on it. Okay. That's Julian. We're going up all these steps. Excuse me. It might have been me. It might have been my arrow that did it. Who are you? What is this? We detected. Oh, hello. Keep an eye out for wolves if you're headed up the path to High Hrothgar. All the greybeard. Wait, the greybeards called Dovahkiin? I did. Strange days when the monks will do that. I wonder what it means. <laughs> what are you doing? I like to spend time up here. Walk the steps. Meditate on the emblems. Doesn't hurt when I bag some game along the way. Bag some game? What does that mean? I'm not a step stool. They're not the sort to take visitors. But I never go that high up the path anyway. Some folk who make the trip leave them food or other essentials. But not to make conversation. Aye. Aye, 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 aye. Pick up chicks? Oh. Where did you come from? Well, I'm push this away. Use my paws. Oh. Just kidding. Lydia's here to save my life. It's a high fantasy game. If he wasn't dramatic, he'd look weird. That's fair. Why am I crouching? Oh, is this a thing that means a cave is nearby? Oh, I think I missed the, the second emblem. The fledging spirits of men were strong in old times, unafraid to war with dragons and their voices, but the dragons only shattered them down and broke their hearts. Oh. Like, physically broke their hearts. Because they ate them. Probably not. Wait, no, this is the, the, the graybeard, so no. Yeah, the second one was when we talked to the guy. Uh oh. Oh, we're going down and up again. Hi, 
Kelly. Welcome in. Yeah, Fox, it's my very first time. I've never played it before. Oh, who the f is this? Keep an eye out for wolves if you're headed up the pass to Hyrothka. Okay. Huh? Did you hear the Greybeards call Dovahkiin? I was just outside Iverstead when it happened. It's an exciting moment. Nothing like this has happened in centuries. Who are you? Just a pilgrim. I'd prefer to leave it at that, if you don't mind. What are you doing? Walking the steps, meditating on the emblems. I make this trip every few years. Hmm. I. I I. She said the exact same thing the other person said. Kind Keen called on Parthurnax. Parthurnax. I'm not gonna pronounce any of this right. Who pitied man? Together they taught men to use the voice. Then the dragon war raged. Or then dragon war rage, dragon against town. Mm hmm. I. I have a piece of granola stuck in my tooth. Yeah, they only teach men? It is. Okay, we might have to deal with wolves. <gasps> oh, what the f is that? Oh. Oh. Hello. Where did you come from? Oh, this is a bigger boy. Dude, Lydia's getting just swamped. Oh, shit. Oh. How come my hand wasn't swinging? I'll try it on a quick save. Where are we starting back at? Why is it dark? Where are we? I need you to pitch in a little more around here, dear. I help. I do the chores. What else would you have me do? Okay. <clears throat> Hey, at least now we can read the second emblem. Oh. <gasps> that takes care of that. Oh, geez. I have a piece of something yeah my legs are gonna be jacked i have to replace my um battery in my headset hold it's been a few days collect what the the pelt from the guy we just killed okay i know he was looking up at me Oh, you thought it was your thunder? Hmm. It's loud. The sound effects for the thunder are really well done. Oh. Excuse me. 
God of War axe. I know, right? It does look like that. Oh. Keep an eye out for wolves if you're headed up the path to high rock. <clears throat> Sorry. Men were born and spread over the face of Mundus, the dragon. Uh, dragon. The dragons presided over the crawling masses. Men are weak, or men were weak then, <laughs> and had no voice. Just how I like what? Spread or weak? Or both? <gasps> Wolves. Watch this. Oh no, you oh, don't. No. How do I? I want. Can I change what arrows I'm using? Like from like a hotkey type thing. Wow. Oh, that interrupts the running. I see. What is high? Nice. Stevie, happy six months high. We're moving. So we just have to get past that girl and then we, we haven't, um, we've read all the other ones. Thinking about spreading weak men. What of menace? Yes, it's lived the hard life. <laughs> hmm. Uh, Emilia, thank you for the seven months. <laughs> yeah, I think we should all know a little bit less about each other. Yeah. Mr. Seven, what? Okay, I'm gonna do a quick save now. Before we get to this troll. I'm doing it right now. Oh, it's a dragon! That wasn't there last time. I already auto saved. I already auto saved. I'm trying to get the piece of granola or maybe what I don't know what it is. Almond? And my tooth. Oh what the Oh, baby. No, because we still got this. Am I shooting Lydia on accident? Wait, I should I just use my pause? Oh, mama. Good thing we saved. She is essential. I need better arrows and also a better, uh, you know. Oh, we have to deal with the dragon no matter what? Maybe we just, you know, go around. Respectfully. Oh, 
don't mind me. <laughs> Mountain climbing. <laughs> Look at what we just dodged. But like, if we took that dragon out, that would be kind of cool. But aren't, aren't we like pals with dragons now? You know what I mean? All frost trolls can get fucked. Yeah, he was hitting pretty hard. With roaring tongues, the sky children conquer, founding the first empire with sword and voice, whilst the dragons withdrew from this world. Where is Lydia? I think Lydia might have seen brighter days. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> There's Lydia. Hello, Lydia. Does she just kind of revive? You can morph. Wait, so she's dead dead? I've entered a command state. What do you need? Is there anything else you need? What's on your mind? Okay. Do let me know if I can be of service. Does that mean that she killed them or no? Does that mean she might have just gotten away? Probably not. What is this? For years all silent, the graveyard spoke one name, Tiber's Septum. Stripling then was summoned to Hrothgar. They blessed and named him Dovahkiin. Oh. She probably just loaded to me. So we, we saved her, sort of. Oh, this is where we need to put the uh, offering for that guy for that quest. Right? What do I, where would it be? Oh, this one, right? Clemex Supplies? Nice. So these are the gray beards? Are they all gonna have gray beards? Oh. Hello? So, a dragonborn appears at this moment in the turning of the age. What does that mean? First, let us see if you truly are dragonborn. Let us taste of your voice. He wants to hunt. Oh my god, I'm on the spot. Your shout will not harm us. What's the shout button? Is it R? No. Q? No. How do I scream? Z. Dragonborn, it is you. Welcome to High Hrothgar. I am Master Angir. I speak for the Greybeards. Okay. Now, tell me, Dragonborn. Why have you come here? I was hoping you would tell me that. Who are you? What is this place? I want to find out what it means to be Dragonborn. Who are you? We are the Greybeards. Followers of the Way of the Voice. You stand in High Hrothgar, on the slopes of Kinarith's sacred mountain. 
Here we commune with the voice of the sky and strive to achieve balance between our inner and outer selves. Ooh. Sounds nice. <sighs> Do the roar. We are here to guide you in that pursuit. Just as the Greybeards have sought to guide those of the dragon blood that came before you. You mean I'm not the only dragonborn? You are not the first. There have been many of the dragon blood since Akatosh first bestowed that gift upon mortal kind. Akatosh. Whether you are the only dragonborn of this age, that is not ours to know. There could you be more? You are the only one that has been revealed thus far. That is all I can say. Hmm. I'm answering your summons. We are honored to welcome a dragonborn to High Hrothgar. We will do our best to teach you how to use your gift in fulfillment of your destiny. What is my destiny? That is for you to discover. We can show you the way, but not your destination. I'm ready to learn. Did I enjoy the troll attack? Not, not particularly that one. You have shown that you are dragonborn. You have the inborn gift. But do you have the discipline and temperament to follow the path laid out for you? Uh, that yes. remains to be seen. Without training, you have already taken the first steps towards projecting your voice into a thum, a shout. A thum. Now let us see if you are willing and able to learn. When you shout, you speak in the language of dragons. Thus, your dragon blood gives you an inborn ability to learn words of power. Okay. All shouts are made up of three words of power. As you master each word, your shout will become progressively stronger. Master Einarth will now teach you Ro, the second word in unrelenting force. Ro means balance in the dragon tongue. Combine it with Fus, force to focus your thumb more sharply. Oh, okay. That's why they say those things. What the heck is this? I learned it by standing on it? But learning a word of power Not hear of the music, my guy. In a shout. Well, that is how the rest of us learn shouts. As dragonborn, you can absorb a slain dragon's life force and knowledge directly. Mm -hmm. As part of your initiation, Master Einar will allow you to tap into his understanding of Rome. Okay. Whoa! Is he giving it to me? Demonstrate your Use unrelenting, your unrelenting force, shout. force shout to strike the targets as they appear. Where? What's e Press E to shout. The longer you hold it, the more words that will be spoken. Oh. Use both words if you can. I just wanted to do a little tap. Are they gonna give me another guy? E oh. Use both Fus and Ro. Together they will make the shout more powerful. I accidentally forgot to hold it again. Okay. Who's next? Well done. Again. Cool. Who's next? You learn quickly. Once more. Oh, girly pop, you better move. Oh. 
impressive. Your thumb. <laughs> Lydia. You show great promise, Dragon. We will perform your next trial in the courtyard. Follow Master Bori. Who? Who's okay? Going in the courtyard. She's clingy. Lydia. Dude, these men are just Jedi's. Look at them. Oh, goodbye. This is so cool looking. This is very, very Dark Souls-y looking. Guess I'll walk slow. Oh, hello. You will now see how you learn a completely new shunt. Master Bori will teach you wood, which means whirlwind. Oh. Oh, what is oh. You must hear the word within yourself before you can project it into a thumb. Like hopscotch. Whirlwind. Gimme. Ooh. Master Wolfgar will demonstrate whirlwind sprint. Then it will be your turn. Master Bori. Rex! Wolf! Attack! Now, your turn. How you do that? Stand next to me. Master Bori will open the gate. Use your whirlwind sprint to pass through before it closes. Oh! This is Zoomies? Rex. I don't know how to do it. Try it again. Breath and focus. What is he? What am I doing? Oh. Oh. Come, Dragonborn. Attend to Master Bori. What button is the zoomies? They didn't tell me, I don't think. Come, Dragonborn. Attend to Master Bori. Oh, I have to equip the shout? Oh, 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 oh. So it's gonna be, it's going to be Z again. I should probably hotkey this or something. What? Zoomies! Sweet. So, uh, did you like it? Your quick mastery of a new Thum is uh, astonishing. I'd heard the stories yes. of the abilities of Dragonborn, but to see it for myself. I thought it was this easy for everyone. I don't know how I do it. It just happened. Thank you. What's next? No, indeed not. But beware that your skill does not outstrip your wisdom. Damn. You are now ready for your last trial. Retrieve the horn of Jürgen Windcaller, our founder, from his tomb in the ancient fane of Ostengrad. Remain true to the way of the voice, and you will return. Ooh, wait, these are... This is interesting. Why are the dragons returning? Does it have something to do with me? No doubt. The appearance of a dragon born at this time is not an accident. Whoa, Your fellas. destiny is surely bound up with the return of the dragons. You should focus on owning your voice. And soon your path will be made clear. I will continue my training. Surely there's more you can tell me? Why not? There is indeed much that we know that you do not. That does not mean that you are ready to understand it. Do not let your easy mastery of the voice tempt you into the arrogance of power. That has been the downfall of many dragonborn before you. Mm. What does it mean to be dragonborn? Dragons have the inborn ability to learn and project their voice. Mm -hmm. Dragons also are able to absorb the power of their slain brethren. 
A few mortals are born with similar abilities, whether a gift or a curse has been a matter of debate down through the centuries. What you have already learned in a few days took even the most gifted of us years to achieve. Some hmm. believe that dragonborn are sent into the world by the gods at times of great need. We will speak more of that later. When we were sent in by a god? Why are shouts in the dragon language? Oh. Dragons have always been able to shout. Language is intrinsic to their very being. There is no difference in the dragon tongue between debating and fighting. Shouting comes as naturally to a dragon as breathing or speaking. Mm. In mythic times, when mortal kind was in great need, the goddess Kinneret granted us the ability to speak as dragons do. For most people, long years of training are required to learn even the simplest shout. But for you, the dragon speech is in your blood, and you learn it almost without effort. Nice. There are only four of you, question mark. Oh. Five. Our leader, Parthenax, lives alone on the peak of the throat of the world. When your voice can open the path, you will know you are ready to speak to him. Mm. Tell me about the Greybeards. We That's them, obviously, the way right? Of the voice, yes. According to the teachings of our founder, Jürgen Windcorn. Very few are permitted to study with us here at High Hrothgar. But in your case, Dragonborn, it is a privilege to guide you towards mastery of your voice. Thanks. Who was Jürgen Windcorn? He was a great war leader of the ancient Nords. Master of the voice or tongue. After the disaster at Red Mountain, where the Nord army was annihilated, he spent many years Wait, pondering Red the Mountain. meaning of that terrible defeat. Are we trying to find someone that has a name Red in it? To realize that the gods had punished the Nords for their arrogant and blasphemous misuse of the voice. He was the first to understand that the voice should be used solely for the glory and worship of the gods, not the glory of men. Mm. Jürgen Windcaller's mastery of the voice eventually overcame all opposition, and the way of the voice was born. What is the way of the voice? Wait, why is this dialogue light? We study. Very few are permitted to study. But in your case, Dragonborn, it is a privilege to guide you towards mastery of your voice. Why don't the others talk? Their voices are too powerful for anyone not trained in the way to withstand. Yeah, it's, I thought I asked Even him that. a whisper could kill you. Oh. What is the way of the voice? The voice was a gift of the goddess Kinneret at the dawn of time. She gave mortals the ability to speak as dragons do. Although this gift has often been misused, the only true use of the voice is for the worship and glory of the gods. Mm -hmm. True mastery of the voice can only be achieved when your inner spirit is in harmony with your outward actions. In the contemplation of the sky, Kinnereth's domain, and the practice of the voice, we strive to achieve this balance. But I don't follow your philosophy. Why help me learn the voice? The dragonborn is an exception to all the rules. The dragon blood itself is a gift of the gods. If we accept one gift, how can we deny the other? As dragonborn, you have received the ability to shout directly from Akatosh. We therefore seek to guide you on the proper use of your gift, which transcends the restrictions which bind other mortals. Yeah, this is still lit up. We clicked that already. Is there another thing? The voice, although the true master in the contemplation of the sky. Oh, Kinnereth there's another domain and the practice of the voice. We hmm. strive to achieve this balance. As I said, you will know you are ready when your voice can open the path to him. Okay. No doubt you should focus on honing your voice. And soon <clears throat> your path will be made clear. I think we've heard that already. Sky above, voice within. Okay, goodbye. 
Okay, well. Retrieve the horn from Jurgen Windcaller. Oh, yeah, the red guard woman. That's what I was thinking of. The red. We've heard red. I miss the only time you'll use Whirlwind. Oh. Is Whirlwind the zoomies? What? Oh. Hello? They don't talk to us. I forgot. I, did I get to ask them why they don't talk? I like using whirlwind to create distance to hit a bow shot as a follow up. Mm. Um. Question. So on the compass, when it has a little thing, is that does that mean I need to go indoors? Like it's leading me to a door. That black bit underneath. Like that it's not outside. Is that what that means? Correct? Oh, cool. Uh, I have a few mods toggled on um, Big Country. Your training proceeds well, Dragon Ball. I have nothing else to say to him. When guide you. Does it want to mean just to go? Oh, it's whoa. Well, that's a track and a half. We can do this because we finished this. Really? I need to play a this is my first um Elder Scrolls game. I haven't done Oblivion. Well, maybe we just fast travel down to uh I have that that's where we have yeah, we need to go um Turn into that guy. I am a cat. You there. You're the one they call Dragon Ball. Who are you? Are those Oh Oh, a cultist. Did I just say I don't know what you're talking about? Your lies fall on deaf ears, deceiver. The true dragonborn comes. You are but his shadow. When Lord Mirak appears, all shall bear witness. None shall stand to oppose him. What? You wanna go? Who the fuck is that? Your fancy magic someplace else. Okay. Where the hell did they go? Staying safe, I hope. I'm trying to. Read the note. Um. 
Oh, board the vessel Northern made and docked at Raven Rock. Take it to Windhelm, then begin your search. Kill the false dragonborn known as Cat, period. <laughs> Before she reaches Solstheim. Return with word of your success, and Marak shall be most pleased. Okay. Hey. Ah, oh, good. Quite a climb, wasn't it? Yeah. Anyway, much appreciated. Here, take this for your troubles. 500 gold? Thanks, man. Be seeing you around. Be seeing you. Oh, she's still alive, thank goodness. All right. I'm going to here to sell things because I know where this is. I, I Dragonborn. Girlfriend, it is so dark. <gasps> oh. It is my honor to stand before you. Oh. <laughs> Girls, I cannot do this. If this is your first time with us, let me extend a personal invitation for you to drag out your brushes One more and hour. paint and paint along with us each show. Thank you. There we go. Hi, man. How was your stream? Hello. It is thundery, but it's like not even really raining. Oh, I kind of see the rain. How was your stream, Mads? Hi. I know it's very stormy. Whoa. Go put those away. I guess I need to put away too. Thank you so much for taking care of those thieves. The Riverwood Trader is back to the way it used to be. Okay. Ah, good to see you. You and me, we're the only people around who aren't complete fools. Can I not sell? The Riverwood Trader is everything you need in a general store. How come I can't sell anything? My sister Camilla or I will be happy to help you. Cool. Oh, I can just take the gold? Too early? Like his store's not open too early? Are they only open at certain times of the day? Riverwood's agreeable enough, I suppose. For an you and village. me. Oh. Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. I see. Fishing rod. Ooh. 13? Wait, that's a sick sword. I think I might get rid of this now. Nice. He likes you because of the quest, so he'll let you take cheap stuff for free now. Oh, yeah, because I got the claw back for him. I see. Hmm. Wait a second. I just bought everything from him, didn't I? How? How do I? How do I?
What time is it? Thank you. Some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. Okay. That's an interesting mask. Ooh, Magicka regenerates 75% faster. That's actually really good. Yeah, these didn't have anything on them enchantment-wise. I know, I would get ripped off. I, I can't say, oh, I accidentally bought everything and changed my mind. Okay, so we should be going all the way over here. Oh, y'all, we're going to go on an adventure. Oh, I don't know what path to take. Yeah, cultist armor is heavy. Mm -hmm. But I can disenchant it, can't Still I? Here. Can I do that um here? Very good. Or where would I go to disenchant stuff so I don't have to carry it anymore? And I can just sell it. Not here. Dragon's Reach. Go cast your fancy magic someplace else. Oh my god, get over it. Um do I go in here? Is this the spot I want to be? To enchant an item, you must know an enchantment and have a filled soul gem to power the enchantment. Enchantments are learned by disenchanting, destroying enchanted items. Yes. Increases my health by 20 points, but I'm wearing this and I'm also using this. So I don't want to do that. And these are all items I can enchant, is that right? Disenchant and then... Hmm. You can create potions and poisons by combining two or more ingredients that share a common effect. Experiment with different ingredients to learn their effects. Oh. Do you guys make potions a lot or not really? That's cool. Enchant- disenchant these? Hi, Lydia. You loved making potions all the time? You do when you're a mage. Was he sleeping? What are you doing that for? <laughs> it's good to see you again. Whose side are you on? If it's the war you're referring to, I'm on the side of Whiterun. No doubt General Talius and his friends in the Empire will tell you that I owe them my loyalty. And perhaps I do. Ulfric Stormcloak would say that I owe my allegiance oh, to the Nord arrows. people as they fight for Skyrim's independence. Perhaps this is also true. The day might come when I am forced to draw my sword for one side or the other. But that day has not come yet. Okay. 
Can you protect Whiterun from the dragons? With good planning and constant vigilance. I don't know if we asked him this last Even night. Even now, my court wizard, Ferengar, continues his research into ways we might drive back these terrors. We must also have ample reserves of water to combat the fires that will surely spread after an attack. But our greatest weapon? Courage. For if we cannot kill the beast, we must at least have the tenacity to drive it back. Until brave heroes step forward to destroy these monsters, that is the best we can do. Okay. Keep safe. No, oh, you. Oh, it's Irleth. Um, where is the most nearby um place to sell things? Like a general store. Quelvix, welcome in. Hi. Yeah, that's what I thought, Bloodlit. By the main gate. Multiple. Sh yeah, it's a big city or town. one gold oh thank you divines bless your kind heart why are you begging it's it's what Brennan said I should do he's the only one that's been nice to me since since mama oh since she died oh my aunt and uncle took over our farm and threw me out said I wasn't good for anything I wound up here but I, I don't know what to do I miss her so much I could adopt you? Oh. oh. Do I have to take care of her? Can I? I wonder what the dialogue is if I say I could adopt you, but I don't have a house. So she can be like, you don't even have a house. What are you doing? Really? Do you? Do you have a place I could live? Oh. <laughs> no, I don't. Oh, well. Thanks anyway, I suppose. Poor thing. You homeless? Looking for nah. my husband, Nazim. Check the Yarl's backside. That's usually where he stuffs himself these days. Stuffs himself? I work with my mother to sell fruits and vegetables. It's fun most days. Where's the entrance? Oh. It's not easy being a woman in Skyrim, I know. But stay strong, and men will come to respect you, and maybe even fear you. Ophina. Okay. That's not the main... We're in the... I don't know my way around these parts. Is this it? Is this the... Is this... There's a blacksmith. They'll take my weapons, right? Let me know if you see anything you like. Oh. Oh, hello. Um. Welcome to War Maidens. Now you, my girl, have definitely come to the right place. My girl? We've got small weapons as well as big. Maces, daggers, that sort of thing. Take a look. It's in a book. A reading rainbow. Oh, mine, please. You know what? I wouldn't mind buying a nice bow. Thoughts? Why? Oh, it's starred because it's, um... Why am I coming here? Oh, I was gonna sell this, that's why. Because I disenchanted it.
Hunting bow of fatigue, it does five points of stamina damage. Because I think, I think I just, oh, that's expensive though. I'd get that beard messy, Mel, what? Anyway. Good doing business with you. One thing everyone can agree on. This war is bad for business. It's so true. Um Should I get a new bow or do you guys think I should just deal with what You've I have? Got arms and armor of all kinds. Cuz I feel like what I got is a little pooey. Oh, I can sell one of my bows. You look like maybe Take a look. I found a book, Green Rainbow. Oh. I sold that, right? Nope, I bought three. Great. <clears throat> Ringo, nah, nah. I'm not. I'm behaving. Okay. I guess I'll just keep my bow I have. It just feels really, really low. Don't look at don't look at Mel's chat history, huh? Go to the guy across the way, he sells bows and arrows. Back in White Run, that? Storm cloaks, imperials, dragons. Ain't no matter to me what I kill. Let them come. Who? I used to be an adventurer like you. Then I took an arrow in the knee. Here or the place I was just at? He said the line? What did he say? What did he say? Oh, the drunken huntsman. Oh. Oh. Hello. Ah, hello, my Khajiit friend. In oh! The for some supplies. I used to be an adventurer like you, then I took an arrow to the knee. Oh, I've heard of that. I think. What are you hunting? Never mind. I don't want to know. Oh, Imperial Bow. Imperial Bow Dismay of Dismay. Oh, wait, that's sick. That's expensive. Wait, I can't afford it? Thoughts? Wait, is Lydia holding some things of mine that are a little bit pricey? Thank you very much for your business. I'm right behind you. Here's everything I have. <gasps> oh, yeah. I was going to, um... I was going to disenchant this. Let me, let, yeah, let me go do that super quick. I'm going to disenchant this, and then... Why does she have a steel sword? She'll keep the scales. I don't... Oh, you know, I think I just gave it to her so I can, um... I'm gonna go disenchant it and then sell it. You can't afford not to have it. Wait, Robo, what do you mean? Like, I should be getting that bow, or what are you talking about? I work for Bellathor. Oh, she know That's her weapon. Oh, so she doesn't have a weapon. Oh. I am sworn to carry your burdens. So I need to give her that sword? That's hers. Now she has a sword. Do let me know if I can be of service. Never you. Come by Bellator's shop. Sure that's something. That's what I thought. Okay. I'm gonna disenchant. 
Come to chat with an old woman. Do your good deed. There's a root here in Hi, cat. I think everybody was behaving. It's, it's been okay. Purple, what? Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostilities, like the rest okay. of the group. Destroy this, yes. Okay. Cool. No, I don't... Who the hell is this? Father says I'm too young to train with the sword, so I practice with my fists. Lee, what? Can't wait to cut Highly. one of these rebels. Your children, your very lives. Who is that guy? Nothing. Nay, worse than nothing. Oh, it took years. But I earned my way to the top. I own Chilfero Farm, you see. Very successful business, obviously. Good for you. He's a yapper. Yeah, I man, he's yapping. What are you looking at? I'm not afraid of you, you know. Even if you are my elder. You want to get adopted or not? Watch that mouth of yours. Come to chat with an old woman. Mm -hmm. Do your good deed for the day. She, she's gonna do me a good deed. A deed. That's a different kid. Oh, I could tell. Make a yapping emo. I need to make several. From Dragon or Giant. We'll do um, several emotes for our animated ones. Because we have so many slots. That's not the homeless child. Uh oh. Ah, hello, my. Bows hello, my... and arrows for the mighty huntsman. Thanks. Okay, I'm going to sell. Y'all. What did I just disenchant? Oh, did I just straight up destroy it by learning it? So I can't, it, I don't sell it, right? So now, oh. F. I should have just sold it. But I guess I learned it and leveled up. So I guess it's not that bad. How? So I can't, I cannot afford a better bow. Like this would be sick to have, right? But it's 9.55, so should we just go, maybe I should, can I sell some pelts or something? Sell food. Oh, yeah, I should just sell food. I sold everything. This is all I have. You can always go to farmers and pluck their crops and sell it back to them. Leftover armor? Do I have any? I don't have any doubles. Hmm. I want to get that new bow. So I have 918. How much is his bow? 955. I want it. 
Thank you very much for your business. Now I don't have a bow at all. I've got your back. Very good, ma'am. Randy, what's good so far? Boys, girl, help. Hey. Um. So is there like a little garden thing that I could take stuff from and just sell? Go pickpocketing. Last time that happened, I got put in a jail. But also true, I could. Do I have ore to make stuff? Where would that be? In the miscellaneous? Should I go to the blacksmith table and make things? Got some good pieces out here if you look. Can I use it? I don't claim to be the best blacksmith in White Run. Orland. Oh. I think I can create. Is this all the stuff I can create? I'm assuming everything that's white I'm available to create. I might as well just do this, right? Because it's worth 30. Or. Wow. Julia walking the up. Oh, wait. Should I make this? That's worth 160. Wave, 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 seven. Make that ring. It's 160. Not nice. bad. Reminds me when I first started smithing. Smithing. Okay, that's all I need. I just need to sell that ring and then we'll have enough for the bow. Have you met my father? No. He's a steward up at Dragon's Reach. Oh. Good for him. Rings are super good to sell. Ah, hello, my Khajiit friend. Take a look. Khajiit friend? I don't even know your name. Elrindir. Am I fried? Where is it? Where's the, the ring we just made? Can I not sell it to him? Thank you very much for your business. Oh, it's an apparel. He's not going to buy it. Shite. Okay. There's a general trader in the stall area. So I need the stall area. What Whereabouts is, is the stall what area? Do you need? I work with my mother. Talk something. about your mother one more time. It's fun most days. Oh, hi, Dewey. What if now? Oh, this area? I ain't done nothing. There's a root here. In Life's hard enough with all these men propositioning me. But that bard is the worst. Uh oh, someone giving you trouble? Mikhail is begging for a dagger up against his throat the way he goes on about me. Oh, her her broom is in her face. Conquer me as a true Nord conquers any harsh beast. Do we happy 46 months? What if I talk to him? If you want to try, go right ahead. I don't think anything will get through that thick skull of his, though. I won't make it. Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Okay. Wait, oh, she won't take it either. I can sell my fish to her, though. And a pile of salt. Remember, fresh fruit and vegetables every day. Alright, so meat. Oh, what about... So I basically need to see someone who will take apparel? What about this? What are you doing that for? Give me a moat. It's in baubles for sale. All crafted by the best blacksmith in... Oh, a bit of this. A bit <gasps> oh, here we go. Disgusting man is gifting five subs to us. That's disgusting. Wait, that's hers. That's so disgusting. That's so disgusting. 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 Oh, what did I make? Did I make? I thought I made a ring of 150. But hey, I have enough now. Dewey, thank you for the five gifted. Thank you, thank you. 
Um, Cacti, thank you for the 100 bits also. Building on the left is general, right is potions. You take care of yourself now. Ripe fruit and fresh vegetables for sale. So this one, this is general. Oh, that's a house. Wait. Hmm. Oh, this versus that one? The Bannered Mare. Oh, understood, Lynn. Okay. Yeah, she was able to buy one of the rings for high. We can always just keep it. And, whoa. I spend a lot of time at the market stall so I can learn the merchant's trade. Okay. I need more experience if I'm going to run a game someday. All right. I have enough to afford that bow, though, so I'm going to grab that so we have a nice bow before we go on this journey. Ah, hello, my Khajiit friend. In the market, take oh. a look. I'm in the market for something, yes. So, oh, these are all crossbows. So, okay, should I do this one where it has 20 points of magic damage? Or should I just get, well, the... Oh, I sold mine, lol. Lexi, hi. I'm loving it. It's good. I'm still getting into it. And I'm kind of figuring out the odds and ends, but it's good. Should I get the Imperial? Hold on. Let me go to the... So you guys can see. Should I get this one? The Imperial Bow of Draining? Or should I be getting just the Imperial Bow? I feel like the 20 points of magic damage would be good. But also, this has a lot more damage, the crossbow. Is a crossbow better to have than a regular bow? Or does it just, I don't know. Oh, the magic will run out eventually? Yeah. Oh, they shoot a lot slower. Get a bow, okay. So should I just be getting the Imperial bow then? What did I have before? Oh, I had a hunting bow before. I will find... Okay, let's just do Imperial bow. It's a bit more damage than my last one. Thank you very much for your business. And then we'll have some money that left over too for later stuff. Crossbows are stinky. Got it. Mm, okay, so we'll need a soul gem to re-enchant it. Yeah. Okay. Mmm. I should favor the new bow. Bow, 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 bow. Okay. Um. I think I'll just do four for healing so I don't accidentally click it. Okay, I don't know where my horse is. Is it down there? Is that it? Oh, it is my horse. Okay. So, we need to go over here. Oh, God. Um, oh, this looks like a little town or something, something that we got to get through. So I assume we just hop on the road and go this way. Thank you for the hype train also. Can we name the bow Bill? I 
guess we go this way. All right. Any mods? I have a few. Nothing too intense, and a lot of them I don't even have to gone on, so. I feel like mostly vanilla. This is where we killed the dragon, I think, right? Yeah, the West Tower. Yeah, my first time playing... like a mini map okay so we just do a full right here and follow this i think into the mountains is this a baddie place fort graymore that's close enough oh I just want to say hi. Did you hear something? Oh, wait, these are enemies. We're getting red dots. You can't win this. Now you pay. Oh, Lydia, drop it. Just get over it. Oh, no. I'm sure if I travel far enough, Lydia will be okay. Yeah, Lydia, relax. No more stops. We need to find our way to solitude. Why are we even going to a wedding at this far-flung end of the Empire, anyway? A wedding? I told you, it's the wedding of Victoria Beachy, an extremely well-connected merchant with the East Empire Company. The Emperor's cousin, remember? Hopefully these gifts will put us in her good graces, secure that import deal, and lead the way to an audience with the Emperor. Those guys? These guys are going to a wedding? I won't miss the wedding, right? Yeah, there's a bunch of random encounters. I want to see a wedding. <gasps> Little rabbit. It's tied to a quest? Oh, cool. Did I have to talk to them to start the quest? No? Okay. Oh, is this stuff I can pick up and eat? Or sell? Oh, value too. Uh-oh. Oh, I thought I heard bows going off. <laughs> Free cabbages. Are we still going the right way? Yeah. Uh oh. Oh, son of a. Uh oh. Oh, skeletons! Why is this mouse? No, don't kill my horse! Oh, literally, with all respect, horse, get out. Only a fool lets himself get surrounded. Did my horse attack the skeleton? What are you doing? Amvir's rest? Is there any more skeletons? <gasps> Who the fuck 
fuck is that? What the? Yeah, that's right. Oh, I got a cutscene. Hold. Hi, Tristan. Good evening. Can't spell homie without horse. Mm, that's not necessarily true. I despise the mouse in this game moving over to the monitors because, like, I'm scrolling up in chat on accident and also in, like, the alerts. Also, I'm on the left, the right side. <clears throat> I think it's because I was showing y'all stuff. <sighs> okay. <laughs> oh my god. Open the chest. Oh, was there one? Oh, the one right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I forgot how to do this. Oh. It's okay. I can't open this? I beg to differ. What's happening? Oh, I leveled up. Oh. Why is the music so intense? I thought I was under attack. You opened the master lock? I, I guess so. What's the master lock? Oh, skill tree. Hmm. Oh, baby. Um. Maybe some health. Is can I uh, can I do sneak yet? I'm a little bit confused. It reads sneak 28, like it's currently level 28. And in order to be stealth three out of five, I need to be, I, I don't understand how this works. Hold on, I accidentally scrolled up in the chat again because this effing mouse. Perks are just level locked. Oh, oh, I need sneak. Okay, I see. Why is speech green? Just your friendly reminder oh. that you are loved and wanted by so many people, not even in this chat, but in this world. I may Archery. not know a lot of things, but I know each and every one of you, including you, Julia, will do great things in this world. Cooter, huh? That's very kind and nice. Any kind of selling or buying will improve speech. True. I've seen that banging going on. Should we do archery? Ooh, bows do 20% more damage? Uh, yeah. Sure. We're gonna practice bows. 
I want to be a stealth archer. Yeah, that sounds fun. I feel like I'm not... going the right way anymore. I don't feel like I'm on a... Yeah, stealth archer sounds fun. Wait, where's my horse? You do full pyromancy? Mm, yeah, magic would be fun to play with. We might have to change um, the good old weather. Which way am I supposed to be going here? What? Does this not connect to that? Am I, am I, was I meant to go this way? Does anybody know? Or, or is it easy to get through this? Mirror watch. Nice skull. You did a mage for your first playthrough. It was so hard. Either way works. If it's a challenge to go through this, I mean, all we need to do is get to the other path. Maybe follow the river. I'll make it a little bit lighter because we're not going to be able to see in an hour in the game. So go where? I'm afraid I didn't know where that is. I mean, I can always just try to go up the mountain. I feel like that'd be fun. Skyrim horse it. Excuse me. Oh, they take a bunch of fall damage. This seems like a path. Oh, yeah, I, I kind of got over here. Oh, who the fuck ass are these guys? No. Oh. I'm busy that week. Hi, Palpatines. I gotta park my horse somewhere. Am I hidden? Oh no, Lydia. I can just press F and go in a first person view. Oh, that's nice. I think. Oh, oh no. 
Oh no. Oh my god. Get him, Lydia. Oh no. Oh, she's about to die. Oh, her health bar regenerates so fast. Hey, Queen. Oh. Sorry? What would we do without her? Ash pile? Oh. Now what the heck is this? Oh, snowberries. Lydia is just a little in the way. You had a Daedra heart? I don't know. Yeah, what's this Daedra heart? Is that wild? Been lurking a lot. I just wanted to say you inspire me to give Skyrim a try again soon. You're doing amazing. Oh, thank you, Skeeb. Cheese, please. Hi. It's a cool little item. All right. Horse. Okay, where are we? Oh. Um. I kind of wanted to go over here. It makes stuff. Okay. Cat and horse. Name a more iconic duo. So true. Morgan say your mom and I Morgan <laughs> we we need a mini map I I can't what does the thing on the top right mean with the gold Oh, nice cacti. Wait, what was that? Did I pass a mushroom? Or am I high? I'm high. That was like a bald patch, I think. It's not vanilla? Hmm. I wonder what it is. I'm assuming this is the right way. Yeah, this is where I wanted to go. Okay. <gasps> Check active effects in the magic tab whenever you see things like that. To know what they are. Oh. Can I help you, little rat? Hello. Thank you. I can roast him and eat him. Well, good thing we're not playing on survival mode. Is that vegan? Yes, because it is pixels. Ooh. Agreed. I think this is where we start getting sneaky. <gasps> Girl, ain't no way you saw me. All 
All right, Horse, you stay here. We got some stuff to do. Where did Lydia go? Did Lydia just like streak it, go straight in? Maybe we should save. Yeah, I'm saving right now. Oh, it's a frost tail. Health regenerates? Fire is their weakness? Brother. force wait hold on let me use the force how do i oh we're so out like a kite oh you can hit him with fire to stop it little bit of that do a little bit of this should I do the fire first they'll never see it coming Oh, girl. Oh, he's... Oh. Man's bug. Generating even after using fire. Oh, sheesh. Lydia's down. If this is your first time, <gasps> Lynn! let me extend a personal invitation for you to drag out your brushes and Hi. You came along with us. Hello, I'm trying to kill my first frost roll. Oh my god, he's regenerating. Steel arrows. Oh, these are a lot better than the ones I was using. This is gonna take him down. For sure. did it i was using really really oh, weak arrows nice probably oh i hope y'all don't mind this image lynn hi how is your stream thank you for hosting us hi everyone uh we're playing skyrim for my first time i feel like i'm one of the last remaining people on earth who's never played this game so I decided to do it because I heard it's a nice game to play in the winter. So that's what we're doing. Scott, thank you for gifting the sub to Lynn. You were playing some Power World, but I'm so late game uh, in the game that I don't want to grind anymore. Oh, in Power World or in this game? You also haven't touched this game? 
I'm glad I'm not alone. I know there's a few people who haven't played, but a lot of people have. Oh, I see. Troll fat? Oh. Skull. Winter troll pelt? Sweet. Maybe I should just, like, not have that crap arrow I was using then. Oh, yeah. These do... Oh, these... Yeah, the steel arrows sound pretty good. All the shots I've missed. I played Skyrim for the first time in 2015 and I thought I was late to the party. Oh my, I can't believe it's been almost 10 years since 2015. That is really weird to think about. Um, anyway, I made a cat and I accidentally named it cat, period. Um, it was going to be Kajulia because I thought it was kind of a fun little play on words for my name. But then I accidentally named it Cat, and everybody, I was like forced to keep it. So this is Cat. Oh, save after the troll. So true. Are there baddies here? This seems pretty, pretty bad. An amethyst? Worth 120? Oh shit. Cat. Is this what I think it is? Oh, I don't know. There was a frost roll outside, so if that tells you anything. It's empty, though. I was expecting there to be more guys wandering around. Oh, there's another one. <gasps> oh, okay, hold. Oh, wait, this. What is this? Lost Valley with two GG. Oh, no, the horse didn't die. I left the horse parked outside the town. Oh. <laughs> You didn't see me. Lydia, get him. No, yeah, no, you didn't. Can I just like do a little... Oh, these guys are beefy. What am I doing here? Oh, she's already down. Can I get my arrows back? Oh, I can. Okay. Can I hotkey this stuff too? How many favorites can I have? Sure. There is. Oh, cool. Okay, we'll just have numbers for this. That's the bow. That's healing. The furry fists are so fucking funny. Yeah. Oh no, I didn't mean to use a healing potion, son of a. the chest I uh, I was expecting oh maybe I'm hearing people up there Ted I hope you have a nice shift thank you for hanging 
will leave this room. to be here to share your first playthrough of Skyrim. Same from us. Oh, Lydia's out like a kite. Oh, God. Did I? I think I might have just aggroed. Yup. You hate to see it. Okay, but like imagine I go in the door and I just like reset everything. And I, I aggro literally three. Oh. Do not know me. Oh, good Lord, Lydia. What was that? What do you think? Look around. I'm so high level. Do I have higher damage when I have higher level? Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I think I aggroed another gal. Imagine if I just run and like de-aggro it and then call it that, you know, Lydia can catch up. That health regeneration is wild. Double fire? Oh my god, because Lydia's still attacking it. Oh, good lord. They'll never catch me here. Trolls are high key a DPS check. Yeah. Can't kill them fast enough. really know if there's anything intense I should be getting here or are we just kind of just walking on through I don't know where Lydia is but uh there's a special loot should I be going to it Oh. Oh. 
Oh, there's the boys. Oh, mother of God. I can just like resummon my horse at some point, right? Because I'm 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 out like a kite. I have fire, but I feel like it didn't do much. My sneak is 30 now. I could be even more sneakier. I can upgrade that. <gasps> did I, I? I did level up. Sneak. Oh, um. Oh, that requires 40. I thought it required 30. Wait, does something else in here require 30? Oh, muffled movement. Noise from armor is reduced to 50. Do I want to use that, though? Backstab. Sneak attacks with one-handed weapons do six times the damage. But if I'm going to be doing bows, I probably don't need that. Backstab's amazing. Maybe, well, you know what? I should probably do that for when I don't want to use my bow. I'll trust that. Um, I, currently I'm using just light armor. <gasps> Who is that? Farmer. I'm on my way to Solitude to join the Legion. A united empire is better for everyone. Okay. Join the Imperial Legion. Is Lydia like GG's? Or will she just respawn? Where am I? Um. I think I actually want to maybe. Yeah, go to the right. I need to turn around, I think. I kind of wish I had my horse. Followers won't die unless you, like, accidentally kill them yourself, I think. Oh, okay. Cool. That's... I guess that's good to know. Because that would be, you know, a little bit tragic if... If we get attached to one or, or, or you know, and, and then they just... I want to go north. Yeah, to here, right? I think we kind of do a hard left. Are you bad? Why are you approaching me like that? I've been looking for you. Oh. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. You don't know who I am. Let's see here. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Oh, there she is. Mailman? I'm not going to kill the mailman. What, what did he give me? Imperial bow? Wait, when did I get that? 14? I Did I buy that? Or I thought I had a different bow. That's what I have. I thought this was 10. Or did the damage go up because I leveled up archery? Letter from a friend? Oh, is... Is it the anonymous letter? Oh, yeah, I just started a quest. Someone please help. A group of necromancers are experimenting with conjuring zombies using ancient dangerous magic, which I fear will have unintended and irreversible consequences. I was expelled from their studies as their ambitions grew into folly against my warnings. Folly? 
They're performing a ritual to summon a large group of uh, these foul, uncontrollable creatures as we speak in the southernmost area of Skyrim and must be stopped before it's too late. One of many anniversary edition quests. Oh. I wonder where you have to be for that to just trigger because as soon as I got down onto this, it was like immediate. All the butterflies are pretty. Okay. Well, I guess... Oh, are these guys going to swear? We have a mod for that, I think. Do I have to hit him? Did he just say, oh, fuck? <laughs> Is that all they say? I want to find another one. How do I take... I have a hotkey for this, but then it just goes to both. Why is it doing that? C can there be a hotkey for like, no thanks? This ice. Oh. Yeah, Miley, super, super professional. Hi. Hello. Wait, there's a bear over there? Is that what that means? Faithless Imperials. Why are you called Stormcloaks? At first they called us that to belittle our cause. But we gladly accept being named for Ulfric Stormcloak, the only true High King of Skyrim. We are the true sons and daughters of Skyrim and Ulfric. He is the truest of us all. Oh, with we the fight key? to make our land great once more. To raise up strong, noble thanes and lay low false jarls and the cowards who hide behind them. The sound of our fury is a storm about to break on the heads of our enemies. Our friendship, a cloak of true brotherhood for all who would wear it. Okay. How do you feel about this war? Skyrim is the birthplace of humanity, the birthplace of honor. And those snowbacked Imperials renounced both when they laid down before the Thalmor. Worse still, to pay for the privilege to keep his throne, the Emperor sells Skyrim and our very gods, Talos no less, to the damn elves. And what did Torig do? He and the Owls that supported him, they took the Emperor's gold, sold out their people for a slave master's peace treaty. Ulfric did right killing him. Soon we'll rid Skyrim of elves, their bloody Justicars, and the Yars in their pockets. The whole damn lot of them. Why? And we'll cleave through the Legion to get to them. Ulfric's not running a social club. You don't join anything. Either you're a true daughter of Skyrim, or you're not. Oh. If you are, then you make your way to Windhelm and talk to the man himself. If you're not, well, friend, 
You'd best walk away before this gets ugly. Oh. Until next time. Will Lydia judge me if I pickpocket? These are sick people. I don't want to pickpocket sick people. They're not well. Legion soldiers gleam like fresh fallen snow and clank. She'll judge me? They head this way. How close are we? Oh, we're pretty close. So this must be like a camp that's just right outside where we need to go. Fight. Or die well. I'm not gonna end their suffering. They might be healing. We don't know their story. They always talk about the true sons and daughters of Skyrim, which are the Nords, then let you as a Khajiit join them to virtually kick all of your kind out of Skyrim. So they don't like Khajiit? Peeps? Because they are like thieves. Death bell. Oh, there's a baddie nearby. Detected by whomst? Whenever I go back to playing this game, I'm getting that mod. <laughs> it's so ridiculous. <laughs> it's the way that, like, it just sounds so real, too. Like, they have their own voices. That's funny. When a slow mo happens, is that like a critical hit or something? Oh. Oh, fuck. Bad idea. Stop that. Oh, she just take them all out? Oh. W. I mean, we'll be taking that to sell, you know what I mean? I'm assuming there's like a collect all, right? Take all. Oh, but that's so satisfying going click, 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 click. The door's down here? Wait, huh? Oh, those are stairs. Oh, cool. Wait, what was that? Oh, the woodcutter's axe. Sure, I guess. Selling it. Oh. He's just seeping.
Oh, did I not collect the flowers? <clears throat> Oh, these are baddies, yeah. How heavy? Oh, we're good. I need to buy more arrows too, I think. We're kind of not the one too hot. Are these I don't know if these are pals or not. We're talking about These are foes, correct? These are not friends. They're bandits. They seem less intelligent each time you raise them, if that's even possible. As long as they can swing and make it. Huh? Must have been the wind. You hear that? The others must have found something. We'd better go see. These can tend to themselves for a few minutes. Are we not meant to be in this cave? Oh, that's fresh. That's fresh as hell. They want you to believe you're not meant to be anywhere but you're Dragonborn. Yeah, I'm everywhere. Get, get used to it. You know what I mean? little pick up everything oh oh pack meal take yes, everything of course ma'am how much can she carry Like, she, she's my pack mule, pack mule? How much can she carry? Yes, no shot. She can do everything? Oh, oh, I want my bow back. Are we taking that back, please? Wait. 
No, wait, y'all, she can't take anything else. Okay. I'm gonna take that, and I need my bow back, thanks. So she does have... You know. Like, she's got a... She can only life. carry so much, too. Way home. I don't even know what he had. I think he had a book. Did he have a book? <gasps> oh, a spell. Conjuring undying ghost. Consumes all magic and summons an undying ghost for 60 seconds? The ghost's attributes are equal to twice the amount of magic consumed. <gasps> oh! Flames. I was going to say, I already know it. So we can just... Can we just sell the extra books we get? Oh my god, that's flying. Uh oh, impiders. This is a big... At Where are we? What is this? Oh. Oh my god. Why'd that not hit? Oh, I'm gonna... You have to aim lower? Oh, L. Lydia, get him. Okay, nice shot. Is he running? Oh, to go aggro his other friends? I think not. Oh, he's hiding. I'm assuming there's got to be something nice here. Ooh. I mean, we're going to sell all the stuff we're looting in here, which is good. Good morning, gamer. What if wave? Good morning, Kate. Oh, another chest? Gold? A ruined book? I wonder if that's just nice little lore. <clears throat> oh, I just did the exact same <clears throat> as her. I didn't even mean to. Oh, shit. I haven't saved in a minute. I should probably do that. I'm auto-saving. Oh, it auto-saved right here. Just kidding. Oh, I don't need the baskets. coin pouch back there? Coins? That's a coin purse next to the door. Out, out Back out here? Oh, before we went in? Oh. 25. Not bad. Okay. Still here. Thanks, Lydia. You're a real one. like that oh no i'm too heavy i've got your bag it would be my pleasure 
I can just do everything in my backpack. What weighs the most? Oh, no, that's her. That's a cool sword. Where's my? I thought I had a weapon. Oh, maybe I sold it. I totally sold it. That's a cool looking great sword. But great swords are two hands, and I want a one handed thing, so she can just carry that. Is there anything else you need? What's going on? Oh. Oh, L, 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 headshot. I'll just leave the sword behind. I guess I could just also drop stuff that's just cheap. I hope I'm still supposed to be down here. Oh. There's a baddie over there. Watch this. Okay, watch this, I changed my mind. Oh, almost! waddled your way across Skyrim? Oh, Skyrim because, oh, because you were first learning? I know. I feel like I'm also still in waddle mode. Oh, a dagger. So we must have to go that way. Little bit of a dead end. Oh, wait, hold. <gasps> is this where I came from before? No, this is different. What is in there? It's like an enchanting table. <gasps> I thought it was a chest. I thought it was a chest. That's a no. Fuck. chest bandits are cowards yeah sure that was scary man troll skull have we been in here already Oh. Wait, wow. The 
someone there? Oh, mother... Place just loaded with booby traps. Did she headshot him? <gasps> w. Now you'll pay. What? That doesn't work. Oh, ow, ow, ow. Okay, hold. Wait, not me having both freaking things on magic. Pretty sure Lydia just did that. Thanks. I feel like I might need to go back. I don't know what's in here. I looked right at it. Oh, wait, I missed what? Oh, these dungeons are pretty linear. So we're in a dungeon? Oh, the skeleton died on his own. Way to walk into your own booby trap, not my fault. Did you hear something? Who the f is that the boss? Guess not. thinking about that one little room that was in that other room we were just in that I was going to go towards and I didn't. Oh, is this where I'm going to learn the raw? I learned something. I look different? What did I... This one? Is this what I just learned? Becoming ethereal? The Thuums reaches out to the void, changing your form to one that cannot harm or be harmed. But I can't use it yet. That's what I just picked up, right? Just a new power. <gasps> oh, you can go behind the waterfall. I was just going to go back here as a joke. Oh, no. Oh, he's got a big sword. What was that? I don't know. What do you think? Oh, we need a dragon soul to unlock. So we be we need to kill a dragon. See anything useful? So maybe that's the power was down here and not the door we're supposed to go through. Yeah, there's lots of hidden loot. I do that too. I do that a lot, especially in uh, Souls games. How do we 
get in there. What the heck is that? That is a bad skybox. Yeah. Cave vagina, Spock. Stussy. <gasps> Wait, there's a baddie here. I'm running out of arrows. I would lose my mind if I walked into a dispo and saw Julia on the TV. A dispo? What's a dispo? Isn't there a magic bow you can summon that never runs out of arrows? Long time since I've played Skyrim. Um, I don't know. Is it a magic thing? Yeah, do you conjure just like it constant? Hmm. <sighs> right. Um, I don't know if we're allowed to do whatever this is. Currently. My new shout? I do. Maybe, should I be using it right here? Julia Buck, it's oh. pizza. Didn't work. What is wave? Hi, Damien. Hello, happy 12 months. Is these comments? Um. Oh. Wait, what? Is he? What's the dispo? Am I silly? We have six TVs. They allow us to put anything on them. So today I put your stream. So stoked you're playing Skyrim. Nice. What is Dispo? Oh, a dispensary. Like a, like a, like a Eddie dispensary. Like, like does Edward work there? Nice. Nice. Um, should I F off, like, with this area right here? Eddie's the boss. <laughs> Eddie lives there. I can do this? I gotta get through there. One iron arrow left. Oh, you're saying like the zoomies one, maybe? Oh. Okay. 
Okay. Wait, that's my... I can do that. I can go here. What did I change it to? Oh, six. Okay, that's just toggled on. Um... Oh, girly pops, I am stuck. What? Hey, watch it. Oh, sorry. Whoops. Let me put my goodies away. What? What? I did it. L to Lydia, though. No offense. Are these all boob traps? Oh, ow! Oh, ow, ow, ow! What the fuck? The floor is lava. Oh, how did she get in? Oh, ew, piters. Yucky. Lydia, get out. Content warning? <gasps> Hold on. Exactly, she's looking at us like it's our fault that she's the one standing in flames. Oh, maybe, um, nice. Okay, so we need to level up using our magic anyway. a cat that's trying to throw up. <laughs> oh. Because you... I mean, I am a Khajiit. I suppose that's true. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's a that's a chest. Never seen anything quite like that. Oh. Oh. Okay. Any baddies? Oh, this is a chat. Oh, this is the quest. Read mysterious notes. Dragonbone, I need to speak to you urgently. Rent the attic room at the Sleeping Giant Inn in Riverwood and I'll meet you. A friend. That's so specific. I have to go to Riverwood and rent an attic room? Specifically? Okay. That looks like a massive chest and there is just a note telling me to go 
Oh shit. To go get a, a hotel room? Mm, this is worth 13. I might just drop that like it's hot. So are we just kind of getting trolled because all it was was a note and not any fancy, you know, treasure? If my friend did all that just for a note to hang out, we ain't friends anymore. That's it? Oh. Now we're talking business. Wow. Julia, I'll get the reason. Oh. Spell? Oh, this staff is worth 183. Oh. Oh. Okay. Thank you, Izzy. Thank you for the 11 months. Massive chest hotel room. There's a joke there, but I'm too sleep deprived to think of it. Hmm. I also can't think of what you could mean by that. Well, there are some goodies here. Oh, oh, okay. Less than three. What? Crunchy, thank you for the hundred bits. What in the fucking... We got an auto save. Why are we like in a colon right now? What's going on? POV your yesterday's dinner. I don't trust this. of a coffee. Oh, it's too real. Uh-oh. That one did it. Value. Lounging. Lounging. LOL and just lounging. I'll drop that one. Ooh. Are we back where we started? We are. I recognize this. So we've come full circle. Because we've unlocked the... Oh, what the hell is that? It looks like a collection of pots means you're looting all of them. Maybe? Hmm. No. You have to literally click all of them. Check local map. Oh, <gasps> there's a map for this dungeon. Is that where I came from? Thank you for lurking, Izzy. And if also you're working, have a nice have a nice shift. I hope everything goes well. Oh. Do 
is actually subscribe for your first time. Wait. Y'all, did I already do this? Was I, was this the room that had the, the place where I learned the new thing? Wasn't that there? What is this? Did I miss this? Crunchy, thanks for getting us up to the community. Thank you. I mean, we can just beeline back to it because I, we killed all the enemies, but. Did I miss that? Oh, mother... I forgot about that shit. I don't need to go back, do I? I missed one thing that wasn't needed at all, so should I just leave it then? I don't really want to deal with this fire stuff. What was it? Yeah, I'm gonna use the shortcut now. Oh, was the access to the enchanting table? Yeah, I didn't need to go there. And random loot, okay. Cool. We'll head out then. Huh? I looted this. Yeah, I didn't want to take the shield. Actually, you know what? Can we carry the shield? Because this worth 60. Oh, we can. It's a decent amount. Okay, so we need to go this way. We started. I didn't actually really properly look at this room because there were people here first. Oh. That was also worth 60. I mean, it says 60, but it'll probably sold for... Oh, because we don't have like our chit-chatting, yapping skill high enough or whatever. Oh, there he is. All right, I need to make it like 6 a.m. Okay, that's better. I really want to fix the nighttime setting so I can see at night. I'll definitely figure that out before next Skyrim stream. We gotta chat it up. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, death bell? Okay, so now, what is, what is, world map, right? Am I meant to go back now? Oh, I'm meant to go to Riverwood. Oh, and I have to meet with this, the new friend who wants us to buy a room for some reason. I guess we go back, right? Is there anything I should get over here whilst I'm here? Thoughts? Like, did I get to go to Mirror Watch? I don't know if I ever went to Mirror Watch, did I? I could always fast travel back. That's super true. Because now that we've been here. Oh, I haven't been to Mirror Watch. And I haven't been to Morthal. Maybe we check out Mirror Watch super quick. But I can place a marker, yeah? So I can just be like, oh. Place marker? Yes. And now it's going to be blue? <gasps> oh, okay. I think I hear spiders.
Let me see if I can find a crab so I can show you all my mod. There's, it sounds like one's nearby. You always married Lydia? Lydia's... I mean, she's very nice looking. There's a little critter over there. Like, look at that. Is this a crab? Oh, Where it is. You come from? Fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, kill you. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> That's the mod. <laughs> they just scream off. Oh, fuck. That's all it is. <laughs> the, the mod is literally just the mud crabs say that oh here's another one i'll let lydia do it because i might one shot him where is she maybe i need to do it <laughs> nope she did it it's so silly that, yeah, this is this is this is quality of life for sure. Yeah, I just I just want to like be the fly on the wall of the guy who was recording the audio for that mod, because he he probably just sat by himself in in his office just going oh fuck a few times just to get a good one get a few good ones in to like upload with the mod, <laughs> unless it's a thing. Is it someone else saying off oh, fuck and then someone took it and then put it in the mod? <laughs> I'd love to be his roommate while he recorded. I know, that'd be funny. <sighs> exactly, it's it's the same type of quality of life as the oh. fucking damn it, motherfucker. Oh fuck! Only a fool lets himself get surrounded. <laughs> Oh my god. I wasn't expecting a, like a long-winded thing. Oh, am I cucumbered? I am cucumbered. Yes, my lady. Uh, I need you to make yourself useful. Here's everything I have. We well, yeah, what was that? What exactly was that dialogue? Oh motherfucker. I don't I don't even know what he said. Take my great sword. I'll guard you with my life. I'm still too chunky? Yes, my queen. <gasps> oh, because I took her great sword. I'm silly. It's an honor to serve you. Thanks. Uh-huh. Um, and then take this. Lead on. Okay, we're good. My character's name is Cat. It was on an accident. I didn't mean to name it Cat. I, it was originally going to be Kajulia. Like, Kajit, but Kajulia, because my name is Julia. And then Chris was in here, and he was like, that'd be so funny if you just named it Cat. And he just said Cat. And then so I just typed Cat, period. And then by, like, instinct, my pinky just hit enter. Like, I didn't even mean to do it. And then I, it, like, there was no, are you sure you want to name it Cat? Like, I was just stuck with it. And then everybody thought I was so funny. And then I was basically forced to keep it. So here we are. It, it was like, the, like, you know, just like, you don't even think about it. You just press enter right away. So now I'm stuck as I am just Cat. How fitting. What's going on with this water? Oh, because we start to swim right there. I see why it's all broken. Oh, I was trying to get to... Oh, mirror watch. It's 
Which was here? Katiana Gondoline, the perfect. That is so, yeah, catch is short for Katriana. So true. Yeah, I'll be a cat burglar. Yeah, we did become like a thief. That was what we chose. Is this a bad spot? Oh God. I don't know if these are pals or foes. Detected? Oh. Wait, no, you are a, that's a, we know that guy. Yeah. I mostly deal with petty thievery and drunken brawls. Been too long since we've had a good bandit raid. Oh no, children. Do you like magic? Thalion says I'm good at learning. I like learning about magic. What was I sneaking from then? I'd be a lot warmer and a lot happier with a belly full of mead. Same. Where am I? What is this place? Oh, this is Morthal. Okay, well, I'm glad we discovered it. This is cute. Oh, who's this? What's the Jarl going to do about it? How are we supposed to feel safe in our own homes? Please, enough already. Are they just worried about dragons? I've told Igrid of your concerns. She'll look after you all. Please, go about your business. We have no need for wizards in our midst. Morthal has enough problems as it is. Ah, it's no use. Let's get back to a den. Yeah, maybe we talk. What's about you? Morthal's Unless it's about the mill. I don't have time to talk. Too the much mill? To do. You seem upset about something? The world's going mad, and our Jarl does what? She hides inside with her visions. We need a leader, not some mystic. Wait, is is Jarl like the title? No, uh, please no story spoilers. However, I'm totally fine with like backseating. So if there's like mechanics or just like, oh, you missed that. Like backseating's fine. Um, but yeah, just no, no spoilers. Jarl means king. I thought Jarl was the guy's name. Okay. Okay. How can I? So I was like, why are they talking about the guy in the other us. town? Or she has allowed this wizard Falcon to live in our midst practicing gods know what. And now there's talk of rebellion and dragons. But help could Idgrad be against them? Oh. No. We can only rely on ourselves. You do well to remember that. What isn't the Jarl dealing with? Trust you saw the house that burned down. Peculiar bit of business that was. And that's on top of noises from the marsh in the night. Tales of monsters. Now this wizard in our mist. What's a man to do if he can't look to his Jarl for help? True. Y'all is the mayor, yeah. Each mayor city hold has a Yarl. Okay. Who's the Yarl of um Riverwood, the first place? Is it the guy who took us there? Until next time. Is it called Riverwood? Wow, that feels so far away. Yeah, Riverwood. Is it the guy um who took us there? Riverwood has no Yarl. Oh, it's just part of Whiterun. Oh, Hi, Moon Hall. We can go talk to the guy that was like... Oh. Oh, is this her? <gasps> My lady? Hey, Tamriel is full of wisdom and magic, if one is willing to look for it. Few have their eyes open. I understand you have visions. The divines reveal things to me at times, yes. I do not hide this. It is a gift. Anyone who believes otherwise does not and cannot understand them. Is there some kind of trouble in Morthal? <clears throat> that which is unknown can create unease, even fear. It is to be expected. Some fear our new resident wizard. As they grow to know him, they will accept him. Time will prove me right. Where do you stand on the wall? Oh yeah, which side is she on? I stand where I have always stood. Oh, just Fearing in their town. Oil. Now is not the time to fight The burbs, the suburbs. I fear dark days approach, and all of Skyrim's strength will be needed. Mm. Yes. Id, 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 Idrod Ravencrone. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, is, are you? Mortal doesn't need any trouble. You keep your nose clean, understand? Okay. 
Oh, what does she look like? Oh. I speak and others hear. It is my hope that instead they listen. She's beautiful. I just wasn't her expecting to be. I mean, she did sound aged. In Morthal, there is little to rule, but there is much to teach. And so, I am young. The Legion's always looking for strong, capable warriors. If you think you've got what it takes, our headquarters is in solitude. <gasps> oh. Huh? Wait, the red and the blue flags? Keep an eye out for trouble. It's only a matter of time. Stormcloak versus the Imperials? And they they think the Imperials are bad, but the Imperials probably think the Stormcloaks are bad. Up. That shows that that shows Damn Stormcloak guys. rebels. Oh. Wait. There are, oh, are these Imperials? Not sure you belong here, citizen. Yeah, I don't think I do either. Are these are these the guys that are bad? Oh. Um, do I need to talk to her again? Because I didn't really start any quest, did I? If you've business with the Jarl, I'd ask that you speak to me first. Oh, well, I didn't before, but I guess there's side quests? The Jarl has put out a bounty on some bandits. Here, take a look at this decree for details. Kill the bandit leader located in Orothime? What was the argument outside the hall? Ah, you saw that, did you? Life in Morthal has been troubled lately. The people are uncertain, restless. We nearly look to the Jarl for leadership. Morthal seems like a quiet little town. That's what many here wanted. A quiet life in a quiet place, without the noise or the trouble of a city. Now some worry this wizard Falion will foul it all up. What's going wrong, There's news Falion? of rebellion against the Empire. Strange noises have been heard in the marshes at night. And then... The tragedy with Rogar's home. The men simply seek wisdom. Everything will be fine. There's a child. Mm hmm. Yeah, you don't have to pick either side. Yeah. Yeah, I've heard that there's like <clears throat> the own their own themes of racism in here and and yeah, religious suppression. Yeah. There's a bedroom? Oh. Technically, if I'm thieving anything, y'all. I don't get in trouble if nobody sees it. Is that correct? So is it good that I shut the door on her so she can't see what I'm up to? <laughs> Chat sees it. Shh, guys, it's okay. I'm a cat. You saw nothing. You heard nothing. What does the Dragonborn do once he's been summoned by the Greybeards? Can the Thum be taught, like any skill? Please, excuse you. Casey, shh. Are animals still witnesses outdoors? No. Oh, ew, what the fudge is this word? They say Ulfric Stormcloak murdered the High King with his voice. Shouted him apart. Wait, is did we know if Ulfric is dragonborn or not? Was that mentioned yet? Morthal used to be a quiet place, but then the world used to make sense. Mm. Um, yeah, we'll go this way because I wanted to get to the other town. We know he can shout, that's it. Well, if they're mentioning shouting, I would assume... Well, no, because what was he saying? He was saying that everybody can learn how to shout, but... 
what is being dragonborn? Like, do you have a more powerful shout? Or can you just take the souls of dragons? Like, what? So anybody can learn to shout? We, we can absorb dragon souls, yeah. Up. Hi, Tyler's. Dragonborn has a soul off a dragon, I think. Okay. It's just easy. Oh, yeah. It's easier to learn to learn the shouting. What the fudge? Hello. Oh, it's a fucking spiders. Yucky. Oh, nasty. Wait, where's the blue marker? Yeah, I wanted to go uh, discover the city so we can come back here and see what's going on. Wait, is that a barrier? Is this... Is this place, like, fenced in or something? Wait, I'm... I'm here, pretty much. Oh, wait. Oh. Is it inside this mountain? Oh. Oh! Is this a naughty place? Am I not supposed to be here? You cannot see me. Okay, Lydia, chill. Okay, I kind of just wanted to discover it so we could come back here. Who were we fighting? Requires key? <gasps> Cannot be picked, it requires a key. Oh, find a way inside the tower. New quest unlocked. <gasps> Fun. Oh, did you have the key? Cons. Ooh, a couple torches. His journal. Oh, maybe the journal shows how to get the key. Find a way inside the tower. Oh, I bet it does. Oh, ew. Oh, what the hell are you? Ew, nasty. Oh. Um... He's chunky. He's got some health on him. Chitin. Cool. He had arrows on him. Um, what did that guy drop? Journal. It was a journal. Arvel's journal? Y'all, which one did we just pick up? What was his name? Oh, I'm cucumbered. Yippee! Hans. Oh, Hans journal. Okay. When the eye is doused in flames, the hair will light the way. Okay, I have flames. Oh, he dropped um a thing of, of to learn flames. So that's okay. I've heard that fool Sin Sindnar say it over and over. Breath stinking of ale as if it were a limerick. Given his dark hood, you might think it was a dangerous spell, but so long as no one's hair caught on fire or found imps in their cupboards, the words were harmless. Just the mad rambling of a drink. Of the inn patrons, only I bothered to humor him. We bonded over a bottle of honey brew and the bucket uh, with, which in, with which we had history. So when the elf bit the dust, it was only natural he left his things to me. Among them were countless pieces of junk, including full ownership of the bucket and a spell tomb written in some long dead language. But as soon as I started cursing the old fool from, uh, for willing me his trash, out slipped two items of value, a map and notes of a tower deep in the swamps. It was only after reading that that I realized his drunken words weren't part of any limerick. They were instructions, a way in. 
Now that I'm here, things are getting even more clear. The hair pass part or hair part still doesn't make a lick of sense, but the eye is the stone seal that much I'm sure. Yet nothing I do seems to work. I've doused it in fire from my torch. I've chomp I've chopped kindling for hours and built a bonfire high enough to scorch the bloody moon. Still nothing. Maybe the seal can only be broken with magic. Well, if that drunken fool can learn to cast spells, so can I. I've got that bastard's tomb. I just need to make sense of the words. But I better be quick. The fire seems to be attracting all sorts of creatures from the belly of this unholy marsh. Hopefully I can manage to survive long enough to discover whatever treasure lies within. Cool. So we just need to... Uh, we don't know about the hair bit, but where's the eye thing? Hmm. I... Oh. Um, can I eat something real quick? Okay. Boom. Um. Since survival mode is disabled, eating only gives the increased stat given in your inventory. Oh. Yeah, I was just eating some food to get some free weight off because I haven't gone to sell stuff, which I should really do. Oh, is this the eye? So do I just... Oh, that's the wrong one. Oh. Activate the seal. Okay. Wait, the tower door was unlocked by mysterious forces. Oh. Final Fantasy VII Remake sequel, Rebirth, comes out at the end of this month, so I'm brushing up. Oh. Now you have a home? Wait, this is going to be my house now? No, wait, this is cool. This is my... What? Wait, this is sick. I would love this to be a home. Can you have multiple? Use oven. Mm. So I can just put stuff in this chest? Oops. Did I loot anything from that? Why am I just all cucumber now? Mega speedrun, have a good night. I think you can have multiple homes. Oh, this is cool. Okay, I'm trying to think, is there anything I want to keep that I want to put in here? Yeah, why am I... I shouldn't be. Like, maybe amethysts and stuff? And soul gems. I don't think I need to sell those, right? Oh, I should. Yes, I should get the dragon bones I gave Lydia. Where's she? Oh, I'm right behind you. Um, I need the dragon bones, please. How can I serve you, my thane? Okay, and then I'll just deal with everything else I'll guard you with my life. when we get to the town so I can sell it. Okay. Cool. Maybe some potions and stuff. I don't know. Hi, Urban Legend. Hello. You can sort by weight to see the heavy stuff. Yeah, I. that's the thing is I want to... Um... Okay, yeah, I was just walking slow. Myth of Shield Garaf? Ooh. This is cozy. I like this. Sleep? Okay, I'm going to do a quick save. I'm intrigued by this uh, portal. 
Near Watch Gallery? Oh. Wait, what? I have. Oh. This is cool. Display case. <gasps> this is a cool spot. Put armor on. Whoa. This is so cool. A dagger rack? No, I don't think this is a mod. This was like, I... I... Soil? I can grow stuff in here? A sack? I could... What could I... I could put food in there or something? This is normal game. Yeah, I think this is base stuff. This is cool. Yeah, it's called Mirror Watch. I had huh. to... Oh, this is so neat. Oh, this is not base game? Creation Club content? Is that part of the anniversary edition? Because that's what I have. That's so cool. Oh, and now this is all magic. Huh. That's cool. Um, okay, now let's uh let's fast travel to jeez, that's far away. Uh Riverwood. You thought we were at the college? Oh, that's okay. So they added a really cool house. Oh, my horse is here. Um, it is incredibly dark. I'm going to make it not that way. Yeah. Oops. You can have a bunch of houses. Horse. Actually, you know what? We do want to make it seven so we can sell stuff. That's why I'm here. Yeah, the music is really pretty. Oh, Lydia, chill. Where's our boy? Hello, what time is it? Do I need to wait until seven? Oh. Yeah, I think Thank they, you so much. they just weren't Taking open. Care of those deep. Ah, good to see. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Bit of this, bit of that. Okay. Um. Steel war pick worth two thirty. Oh, fuck my life! I'm buying, not selling. Reload. Thank you so much for taking care of. He opens that eight. Eaves. The Riverwood Trader is back to the way it used to be. Ah, good to see you. You and me, trinkets, odds and ends. That sort of thing. We've all done it. I've done it twice today. Cat. Oh. Restoration spells cost 15% less to cast. Hmm. I want to keep the heart I found. People were saying that this was good. Yeah, to sell all the shit I'm not using, yeah? Um, when we backstab, if we're being sneaky, do I need a dagger for that? Or do I just use whatever weapon I have? 
Survival mode only allows you to save after sleeping on a bed. I've heard survival mode is tough. One-handed weapons, but it can be like a sword. It doesn't have to be anything sneaky. Daggers do more damage. They got more DPS, I'm pretty sure. Okay, I'm just gonna sell these rings. Black mage robes. Ooh, magic regenerates 50% faster. So, okay, question. If I disenchant this, does that mean that that applies to me right away? Or does that mean that I can make that enchantment on anything else that I would wear? The second option, I believe, probably. I would learn to enchant this on another item. Okay. Because can, can you check to see what enchantments you know, or do I have to go to an enchantment table? Oh. Ooh. This is the same thing. Is this we got different aesthetics here? Oh, nice. Oh, yes. How many? Yes. We have to go to the enchantment table. Cool. Hi, Nico. Warning, though, you wouldn't be able to enchant the full 50% to begin with. It'd be more like 5%. Oh, and then you just like... Is it because you have to level up your enchantments? Reading chat is incredibly hard to... Should I be... Should I be right side for this game? Or should I be left side? Oh, I'm gonna sell the shields. With the UI mod, the right side's a little better. Okay, I'm fine to be right side. Enchantment has scaling. You level it up and effects are applied. Okay. Hmm. I'm wearing that. Wait, so y'all, should I just sell things I've already read? Or do I need to keep them like, is there gonna be a quest down the line that requests for Han's journal? Right side top would be even better, I think. I Well, yeah, the thing about that is I, any alert that goes off goes off above my camera. So that's why I have a little space. Yeah, that's true. Like, I've already learned flames. So I don't need that. Maybe I should just... Let me just look at my own inventory. And just... See if I can... Like, I could learn that. Fishing map. That's a very nice paper sound. Oh yeah, we gotta go to the we gotta go to the inn. Mm. The 
Should I um? Traitor. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. A bit of this and a bit of that. Whoa, boy's yellow tunic. Oh, this is his. I'm silly. Ew. Troll skull. Like I don't need these. Um, is there any reason that I should like hold on to the winter troll pelt? Is this only if I'm gonna be making my own armor, which I probably won't be, unless I should be. Thank you. Yeah, if you want to smith. That's true. Cause I, I mean, I could make stuff that's worth way more than these are. I, I like made like worth, right? I like that would be better to do if I had free time. Just go make things to sell. But I can't make anything with the troll skull, so I should just sell that. Make a magic sword. Oh, for myself. This early, you can probably just sell most things. Yeah, like the ruined book. I don't need that, right? Because I can't even read it. Is that just sellable? Wolf pelt. Okay. Till next time. You'd make jewelry from gems you'd loot. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. There was like a jewelry piece that was worth like 150 or something. And I made that and sold it for... I think I, I, it was a little bit less. Okay, so we need to... We need to request a room. Hi. I'm the innkeeper. It's my business to keep track of strangers. Okay. I'd like to rent an attic room. Attic room, eh? Well, we don't have an attic room. But you can have the one on the left. Make yourself at home. Then why the goddamn hell did they tell me to do an attic room? Liars! Just taking a peek. Nothing to see here. We don't get a lot of travelers here in Riverwood. So you're the dragonborn I've been hearing so much about. Girls, let me sleep. I think you're looking for this. We need to talk. Follow me. Is she the friend? Was the code word attic room? Close the door. Sorry, girl. Now we can talk. What she got? Should I pickpocket her? I need to know how to pickpocket. Search large sack. <laughs> Speak. The Greybeards seem to think you're the Dragonborn. I hope they're right. Yeah. You're the one who took the horn? I'm, supp I'm supposed to be meeting someone here. The Greybeards are right. I am Dragonborn. Surprised? I guess I'm getting pretty good at my harmless innkeeper act. What's with all the cloak and dagger? I was expecting someone taller. <gasps> oh, that's so unhinged. Good. The whole point of being in hiding is to appear to be someone you're not. What do you want with me? You'd better have a good reason for dragging me here. I just came here for the horn. Why did she make me? I didn't even loot anything. I went there to get a note to come back to her. Like there was nothing in the cave for me. I don't understand this. I didn't go to all this trouble on a whim. I needed to make sure it wasn't- Like I've talked to her before. Trap. I am not your enemy. I already gave you the horn. I'm actually trying to help you. I just need you to hear me out. You'd better start explaining fast. I don't have time for this. Go on, I'm listening. Like I said in my note, I've heard that you might be dragonborn. I'm part of a group that's been looking for you. Well, someone like you for a very long time. Okay. If you really are dragonborn, that is. Before I tell you any more, I need to make sure I can trust you. 
how do I know I can trust you? What did you take? Why did you take the horn from Ustengrav? Why are you looking for a dragon board? You have, you said the Thalmor? The Thalmor are after you? How can I trust you? If you don't trust me, you were a fool to walk in here in the first place. So you're not wrong. Why'd you take the horn? I knew the Greybeards would send you there if they thought you were dragonborn. They're nothing if not predictable. When you showed up oh. here, I knew you were the one the Greybeard sent and not some Thalmor plant. Oh, because I asked for the attic? Why are you looking for a dragonborn? You remember what most don't. That the dragonborn is the ultimate dragon slayer. You're the only one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Mm -hmm. Can you do it? Mm -hmm. Can you devour a dragon's soul? Yeah. That's how I first learned I was Dragonborn. I absorbed some kind of power from dragons. That's all I can say. That's none of your business. Good. And you'll have a chance to prove it to me soon enough. Why are you looking for Dragonborn? Oh, should we say something else? We remember what most don't. You're the only one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Why was that lit up? I... I mean... Yes. We're very old enemies. And if my suspicions are correct, they might have something to do with the dragons returning. Ooh. But that isn't important right now. What is important is that you might be dragonborn. Okay. So what's the part you're not telling me? Dragons aren't just coming back. They're coming back to life. They weren't gone somewhere for all these years. They were dead, killed off centuries ago by my predecessors. Now something's happening to bring them back to life, and I need you to help me stop it. Okay, what makes you think dragons are coming back to life? I know they are. I visited their ancient burial mounds and found them empty, and I figured out where the next one will come back to life. We're going to go there, oh. and you're going to kill that dragon. Oh. If we succeed, I'll tell you anything you want to know. Okay. Do you know how crazy this sounds? How did you all figure all this out? You should know. You got the map for me. The Dragonstone you got for Faringar, remember? Uh-huh. You were at Dragon's Reach when I gave it to him. So you were paying attention. I arranged to have Faringar recover the Dragonstone for me. It's what I do. I make things happen from behind the scenes. After all, here you are. The Dragonstone was some kind of map? Yes. A map of ancient dragon burial sites. Oh. I've looked at which ones are now empty. The pattern is pretty clear. It seems to be spreading from the southeast, starting in the Geralds near Riften. The one near Kynesgrove is next, if the pattern holds. Hmm. <laughs> a few years ago, I said almost the same thing to a colleague of mine. Well, it turned out he was right and I was wrong. Hmm. You should know. The Dragonstone was a map of ancient dragon burial sites. I've looked at which one. It seems to be spreading from the southeast. Down in the yeah, Gerald's we were... near Rift. Some of these I feel like are lit up, Kynes even though we've already read them. If the pattern holds. Hi, Ivana. Good morning. Kynes Grove. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. Okay. Let's go kill a dragon. Is it? Is this like an escort quest? Like if I say, let's go kill the dragon, do I need to follow her right now? Like, or is she hanging out with us? Or do I need to say, hold on and like be ready to go? You can or meet her there. I think you can just meet her there. I need to get into my traveling gear. Give me a minute and I'll be ready. Okay. She's gonna change. Oh. Oh! That's better. Let's get on the road to Kynes Grove. Damn! <sighs> She'll chat with you if you go with her. Oh, like, we'll get... It doesn't say steal. This is mine. Probably because I chose to say, yeah, I'll go with you. 
<gasps> glow dust. <gasps> Giant toe. Oh, sick. The one is safe. Did she just leave without me? Book of the Dragonborn. <gasps> the Book of the Dragonborn by Prior Ella Emmeline Mendrine, Order of Talos, Wade Non Prior. Mm, yep. Yep. Oh my god, Laura, get your. You just can't sit. Sit around the fire, gather around. We're about to learn about the Dragonborn. Many people have heard the term Dragonborn. We are, of course, ruled by the Dragonborn Emperors, but the true meaning of the term is not commonly understood. For those of us in the Order of Talos, this is a subject near and dear to our hearts, and in this book, I will attempt to illuminate the history and significance of those known as Dragonborn. Down th through the ages, <laughs> most scholars agree that the term was first used in connection with the Covenant of Akatosh, when the blessed Saint Alessia, Alessia was given the Amulet of Kings, or Rings, Rings, Kings, and uh, the dragon fires in the temple of the one of the first, or were first lit. Akatosh, looking with pity upon the plight of men, drew precious blood from his own heart and blessed Saint Alessia with the blood of dragons and made a covenant that so long as Alessia's generations were true to the dragon blood, Akatosh would endeavor to seal tight the gates of oblivion. <gasps> Wait, like the, like the other game? And to deny the armies of Daedra and undead. Or sorry, Daedra, yeah, Daedra and Undred, Undead to their enemies. The Daedra loves uh, Islewides. Those blessed by Akatosh with the dragon blood became known more simply as Dragonborn. The connection with the rulers of the Empire was thus there from the beginning. Only those of the dragon blood were able to wear the amulet of kings and light the dragon fires. All the legitimate rulers of the Empire have been Dragonborn, the emperors and empresses of the first. A uh, Cyrodelic Empire found by Lesia, Remain Cyrodel and his heirs, and of course Tiber Septum, do these words, and his heirs, down to the current emperor, his majesty. Uh, is that a P? Pelagius Septum? Oh, Niblin, let's go. Congrats. Did you start fresh tonight? The awkward and time randomizer? Because of his connection, or this connection, with the emperors, however, the other significance of the Dragonborn has been obscured and largely forgotten by all the scholars and those uh, of us dedicated to the service of the Blessed Talos, who was Tibur Septum. Very few realize that being Dragonborn is not a simple matter of heredity. Being the blessing of Akatosh himself is beyond our understanding exactly why or how and why it is bestowed. Those who become emperor in light of dragon fires are surely dragonborn. The proof is in the wearing of the amulet and the lighting of the fires. But were the dragonborn um, and thus able to do these things? Uh, or was the doing the sign of the blessing of Akatosh descending upon them? All that we can say is that it is both and neither a divine mystery. The line of septums have all been dragonborn, of course, which is one reason the simplistic notion of being hereditary or hereditary has become so commonplace. But we know for certain that the early uh, Cairo Dillic rulers were not all related. There are no evidence that remain that Ramon Cyrodiil was descended from Alesia. Although there are many legends that would make it so, most of them dating from the time of Ramon and likely attempts to legitimize his rule, but we know that the blades, usually thought of as the Emperor's bodyguards, originated in a, 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 a cavalry crusaders who invaded Tamriel for obscure reasons in the late First Era. They appear to have been searching for a dragonborn. The events of Pale Pass bear this out. And the Akaviri were the first to proclaim Ramon Cyrodiil as Dragonborn. In fact, it was the Akaviri who did the most to promote his standing as Emperor, although Ramon himself never took a title in his lifetime. And of course, there is no known hereditary connection between Tiber Septum and any of, or Tiber, any of the previous Dragonborn rulers of Tamriel. Whether there can be more than one Dragonborn at any time is another mystery. Ooh. 
the emperors have done their best to dismiss this notion. But of course the imperial succession itself means that at the very least there are two or more potential dragonborn at any time. <gasps> There's another one. The current ruler and his or her heirs. Mm. The history of the blades also hints at this, although little is known of their activities during the inter uh, interregnum between Ramon's empire and the rise of Tiber Septim. Septim is emperor, okay. Many believe that blades continue to search out and guard those they believed were or might be dragonborn during this time. Lastly, we come to the question of the true meaning of being dragonborn. The connection with dragons is so obvious that it has almost been forgotten. In these days when dragons are a distant memory, we forget that in the early days being dragonborn meant having the dragon blood. Some scholars believe that it was quite literally, although the exact significance is not known. The Nords tell tales of dragonborn heroes who were great dragon slayers, able to steal the power of dragons they killed. Indeed, it is well known that the Akaviri sought out and killed many dragons during their invasion, and there is some evidence that this continued after they began or became Ramon Cyrodiil's dragon guard. Again, the connection to the dragons, the direct pre predecessor uh, to the blades of today. I leave you with what is known as the prophecy of the dragonborn. It often said to originate in an Elder Scroll. They said the thing. Um, in an Elder Scroll. Although it is sometimes also attributed to the ancient Akaviri. Many have attempted to decipher it, and many also uh, have also believed that its omens had been fulfilled, and that the advent was the last dragonborn. Oh, Thanos was at hand. I make no claims as an interpreter of prophecy, but it does suggest that the true significance of Akatosh's gift to mortal kind has yet to be fully understood. When misrule takes its place at the eight corners of the world, when the brass tower walks and time is reshaped, when the thrice blessed fail and the red tower trembles, when the dragonborn ruler loses its throne and the white tower falls, when the snow tower lies sundered, Thundered? Kingless, bleeding, the world eater wakes, and the wheel turns upon the last dragonborn. I think we might be the last dragonborn. Are we taking that? Oh, map of the dragon burials? Yup, we need that. Well, we're no longer stealing stuff now. This is ours now. Oh, I can disenchant that stuff now. Oh, wait. Why can't I disenchant this? Oh, because we already know it. Ah. Uh... Wait. Is that the one I'm wearing? I can't, I can't remember which. I am wearing that, okay. Skyrim would be better with Julie's voiceovers reading the books. Thanks, Kanji. If you destroy an item, you'll learn the enchantment. Yeah, I just don't have another, I don't know if I have another ring to put that on. Maybe I do and I'm just goofy. I don't. But I could put that on anything, right? Could I put that on like a helmet? We'll keep it for now. The rise and fall of the blades? That's a, that's a big book. Hmm, I don't know if I can read a whole other book. Maybe tomorrow. Oh, can I not? Oh, I can't take it. So I have to read this now? Oh, if you disenchant and re-enchant at a probable... Yeah, make sure the bottom left is 
isn't stealing and instead it's taking. Yeah, give me the TLDR. Um, I think, I'm assuming the woman we're a part of is part of the blades. Like, the woman we're about to follow. Because the blades are the ones that, like, seek out the dragonborn. Is that correct? Is that, isn't that what we read in the last book? So I think she must be part of the blades because she said, like, I'm part of the group that's, like, looking for dragonborn. So is that, is she part of that then? If you want more info about the blades, but it's not required reading. Yeah, I feel like the Dragonborn's a little bit better for required stuff, because it's about us. Well, I'm sure we can come back down here and read this. If we feel like learning more about them. Is she gonna, is she waiting for me? Oh, you know what? I bet she's just right outside the store, right? Okay. Um, y'all, it is 1.30 in the morning. I might stop here. And I think we'll be continuing this tomorrow night. But yeah, we got a good amount done today. We'll continue this tomorrow. I hope y'all have a good Friday. Good start to your Friday. We did so good. <laughs>